All right, we got this working. I think we got it working. Hey, everybody. Uh, as you can tell, I am not Lucky Blue, April Fools. Um, we thought we would use this uh, as an opportunity to try me streaming, since people have asked me to and I kept telling them not to. Uh, so yeah, here we are. <laughs> Let's see, great gunpoint. Let the man go. <laughs> yeah, uh, this is something that um, uh, a bunch of my friends uh, outside of the server have asked for, and uh, Blue himself has said that I should try it, so we figured today I would. Um, so sorry, we are not playing Pokemon Coliseum today. Uh, that will be tomorrow. Uh, you'll be back to your regularly scheduled Blue. Uh, but today, it's me, Gray. <laughs> Shut up, Blue. <laughs> um... Yeah, so this is the first time that I have ever streamed solo. I usually just kind of sit back, let Blue tell the jokes, and then I, like, you know, play the game poorly. Uh, today it's going to be me, and uh, we debated what game I should play for my first ever stream, and uh, I kind of thought about uh, the way that he chose Sonic Adventure 2 as his first, because it really, like, shaped a lot of his, um, I guess, gaming adulthood. Uh, so I picked one that was very important to me growing up, uh, and when I say growing up, I mean, like, in my 20s. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna be playing Dragon Age 2. Uh, for anyone who's never played the series, don't worry. Uh, this may be a one and done, uh, but it's a very long RPG. We'll kind of, uh, uh, try it out together, see how you guys like it, see how I like doing this, and, uh, we'll go from there. And wow, this is a lot to keep track of on one screen. I respect everything Blue does now. But, uh, yeah, let's see. There's a button here. There's a button here somewhere for changing to the game. And I believe it is here. Let's see. Ah. That's a switch to HDR, so I, like, lose it every time I go back to OBS. Put on the audio. There we go. Okay, can everybody hear the game? Can everybody see the game? Also, what choice did you choose for the dwarves? Oh, uh, okay. So, yes, for anyone who isn't uh, knowledgeable of Dragon Age, there are multiple games you can port your saves up. I am not porting any saves. I'm not doing anything like that. Uh, I actually usually play on console. Uh, I have the PC version now, and while I have played it before, I've never actually finished it on PC, uh, but I have a bunch of mods installed that uh, uh, should should help it all look good. Um, so we are not importing anything. We're not doing anything drastic like that. We're just going to play through the game like normal and uh, have a little fun. We'll see, we'll see if you guys enjoy it. Let's see. Now, open this. And by the way, uh, thank you, Blue, for setting all this up for me. I didn't know, like, half of how this was done. Oh, I'm still huge. I need to change that. <laughs> Unless you guys just want to, like, see me sitting in front of the whole game, not able to see that whole size. All right, let's see. Make that smaller. Super small. A little small. That looks good, right? A little bit bigger? How big we want it? Like right here? Does that seem normal? There we go. Now I have been smallified. All right. Now, does everybody hear the music? Does everybody see the game? We all good? Cool. All right. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot, like, I was talking in front of it. Okay, so yeah, uh, this game uh, was actually extremely important to me. Um, kind of came at a, a big time in my life, so it's one of my absolute favorite games. Uh, it is a very long one. Uh, we're going to be streaming for about three hours a day, see, see if I can uh, last that long. Um, but uh, we'll, we'll just kind of go through it. It's, uh, it's, it's the second part of a, a So Far trilogy, but you don't need to know anything about uh, the first one coming in. Uh, we're just going to hit the ground running and go with it. So, uh, with that said, why don't we go ahead and start a new game, and uh, let's Let's get cracking. Um, if the volume is too loud on the game, let me know. I'll change it once we actually get some real volume in here. But uh, I figured I would pick this game because I could get a little interactivity with you guys. Um, whenever you're starting the game, you have a, a main character and you can pick their class and gender. 
So I thought I would let you guys pick what I'm going to do. So we have mages who can do ma magic, uh, warriors who swing really large swords, and rogues who are the crafty guys who jump around and go invisible and stuff. Um, we got one vote for female warrior. Was that one right there? What? <laughs> Blue, make fun of him, not me. Blue isn't even streaming here, still giving them shit. Uh, Shadow says, we all gotta be nice to Grey, especially Green and Argon, the latter of which is invisible. Did Argon not show up to our April Fool stream? All right, now we got to vote for male warrior. Everybody likes the warriors, apparently. And the 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 uh, interesting thing is, I like never play warrior. Uh, I almost always pick rogue or mage. Uh, but I can definitely I can definitely play some warrior. Mage dude, sword woman. Okay, <laughs> blue keeps saying sword woman, but I don't I don't think his vote counts, considering he's not streaming. Okay, we, we've, we've got a bunch of votes for Sword Woman. Even when I take out Blue, we will go Sword Woman. Okay, so we'll be a female warrior. Let's go ahead and start. All right, so this is one of the most important games of my life, and I'm sure it will be very underwhelming. Um, this came out back in uh, 2000, I want to say 11. Uh, yeah, because it's a little over a decade old at this point. Um, this is back when EA had first taken them over and was kind of messing up Bioware, but this is like, in my opinion, one of their last good games uh, before everything changed. But I'm I'm a big, big fan of it. But we'll see we'll see how this all goes, because I can't really talk over them while they're talking, but I will do my best. I've had gentler invitations. <clears throat> I am Cassandra Pentecost, seeker of the Chantry. As you can tell, I'm a huge nerd. And just, uh, what are you seeking? The champion. Uh, which one? You know exactly why I'm here. Right in the face. Time to start talking, dwarf. They tell me you're good at it. He narrowly missed his dick. <laughs> what do you want to know? Is she single? Uh, start yes. At the beginning. Since you can romance her in the next game, I assume she's single now. Drop. So this is actually a frame story where the dwarf you just saw, Varric, is the one who's telling the story. And then we play through the events while he's telling it. It's kind of an interesting setup. You know what's really interesting? Since I never played Warrior, I kind of forgot what the Warrior animations were for this part. That was all kind of new to me. <laughs> Scouts. By the way, do you we notice how uh, large her chest is at the moment? Uh, since he's telling the story, he actually kind of embellishes it. You should see how it changes between uh, this, this part and the later part. Okay, now I got to remember how to play on PC. Yeah, this is basically it. Uh, they kind of started from a, like, D&D campaign setup on how they did combat. And then for this one, they tried to style it up a bit. But it really is just, like, clicking things. All these things were fighting. They're Darkspawn. They're, like, the Cinnaban or something. And I am a giant sword girl who is going to kill all of them. We can't keep this up forever. Okay, so here's the big part of Bioware games. If you've never played one, you get to decide how your character responds to situations. We've got like, be a good girl, be sarcastic, and uh, just be kind of mean all the time. I'm gonna let you guys kind of decide at times what we're gonna go with. So do you want to be the really good like cinnamon bun girl, the one who cracks jokes at inappropriate times, or the uh, uh, just mean one? That's kind of all she is. Let's see. We got sarcasm and mean. Renegade for life. Another sarcasm. We'll go sarcasm for now. Perhaps we'll be lucky. 
and they'll run out of darkspawn. But um, shall I deal with them? Ah, uh, sure, go for it. All yours, sister. So this is my little sister, and she is a mage. If you get to do stuff like that, all I do is swing my sword. Also, this is like actually kind of difficult for me. I don't really play with keyboard and mouse very often, but there isn't a controller option. So I'm going to look like I don't know what I'm doing half the time, which I'm sure makes it more entertaining to watch. Man, you really do just swing sword. Why is this Blue's favorite class in, like, every game? We should, like, jumping around and lighting things on fire. Whenever we play games together, so, like, Destiny, things like that, Blue and I, I always pick, like, the roguish one that's jumping around and has to do, like, five different things to kill a guy. He's the one who jumps in with his sword, and, like, that's it. <laughs> that's the entirety of the, uh, the idea. Sato, you thought it was Dragon's Dogma 2. I am so sorry. Dragon's Dogma 2 just came out. I have not gotten it yet. I was a big fan of the first game. I was really depressed when they uh, uh, did the remaster or whatever. They took out the, like, anime as fuck theme song to start it up. Uh, uh, what's it called? Like, Winding Free or something? I missed that song. No, I have not played Dragon's Dogma 2 yet. Instead, we are playing Dragon Age 2, a, uh, like, 12-year-old game. Into free, you're right, that's it. God, that's such a good song. Alright, now we beat up this guy. Is that all you got? The least complex matters are the most reliable. Yeah. Also, for anyone who has never, like, streamed solo... Let me tell you, this is harder than it looks. Keeping up with chat while trying to, like, play a game and not look like an idiot? This is a skill that I don't have yet. <laughs> Man, this game is really cool. I sure hope its story is completed in a satisfying way. Well, let me tell you, buddy. It isn't. Now, brief history of this game, it uh, didn't do as well as they had hoped, so for the next game, they kind of pivoted entirely, and the whole story they set up for this, uh, which I really liked, uh, didn't really happen. But that, that's something I can get into later. For now, let's just kill these last guys, move on. There we go. Dead. One thing I've always loved about Dragon Age is they cover you in blood while you're, like, fighting them. So even in conversations after, you're just kind of, like, just covered in blood. You're doing well, Gray. Thank you, Sato. Bullshit. That's not what really happened. If you notice some changes, uh, there's some pre-rendered cutscenes that I couldn't change. So there will be a difference in like their character models whenever it goes back and forth. You think I know the truth? Don't lie to me. You knew her even before she became the. What is Dragon Age? Please explain it to an idiot, aka me. I don't know where she is now. It is if the makers of Mass Effect wanted to make a D and D campaign. Let me guess. Your precious chantries fall into pieces and put the entire world on the brink of war. Yeah, I modded my DA2 uh, with a, a whole bunch of graphical stuff and together. some stuff just for me. The Nothing crazy. was at the heart of it when it all began. If you can't point me to her, tell me everything you know. You aren't worried I'll just make it up as I go? Not at all. You'll need to hear the whole It's story. edgy D&D. It's not edgy. Not that edgy. Fenris is edgy. We haven't gotten to Fenris yet. You'll meet edgy later. Edgy would be a good nickname for him. All right, so now we get to change our character. You guys, do you guys want to like 
contribute to making the character or just do we just want to like go with her as is because we we could do we could do all kinds of shit Henry isn't edgy he's just sad he's really sad you're right but he is edgy as a result Vegeta's sad too he's still edgy the the reason doesn't change anything but with lipstick okay sure but with lipstick we'll do we'll do some lipstick why not? Uh, can I even change that? Oh, I don't think I can change it. Now we've got red-haired lady. Let's see. We change the hair color. We can make that. We can make that red. Red-haired lady. Zeno says the most chaotic abomination possible. That is an option. Yes. The character is going to be a mess in no time. Yeah. Yeah, but like a mess would be fun. I don't know. I'd have fun with it. What if we what if we go with one of these presets? What if we start kind of weird? Uh, let's see. Which of these? Oh, you could just be Isabella. I guess that was a mod I installed. I don't remember doing that. Let's start. Let's start from base. So we have that thing. We'll do some, some red hair that was requested. Uh, we got, uh, some different hairstyles. Those are some bangs. <laughs> Listen, I don't care what you do as long as she's Scottish. I'm sorry, the voice actor's British. I can't do anything about- Oh, Kara Ticker Shoes gave us five dollars. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I- Oh, Epion Best Class. Damn it, I have to say it, don't I? Alright. Epion Best Class. There you go. Worth every penny. I actually do really like Epion, for the record. Keep that, keep the keep the bangs. Alright. And then I'm hearing green eyes. See what that looks like. Someone's got a type. Eye color. What's really bizarre about the base uh version of this, and blue blue was actually the first one who actually uh showed it to me. Um so you are Hawk, and your whole family is a part of this. So you have, like, a biological brother and sister and mom. Um, every single one has, like, brown eyes, and then you, out of nowhere, just have, like, the brightest blue eyes. But it's only the base female version, and I don't know why that is. Let's see. Those veins, green eyes. Gosh, English. English. <laughs> That's a downgrade. Yeah. Is the... Is the given to make an ungodly, ugly character with such character customization? Is it given especially in this day and age? Yeah. Make make Aveline. I mean I could. Now long whiskers. I don't I don't have long whiskers. That's a different game. I don't know, nostril width? Are those is that is that good enough for whiskers? Tip width. You got a big nose now? Is that good enough for whiskers? He's not a cat. Neck ears. What? What what do we have? Oh, I can't even see your ears. That doesn't even matter. Move the blood on face. Well, in that case, we're going to have to completely start over. There we go. Here, I'm going to do this real quick. We got red hair. One of the the bangs. Oh. Oh, we could just like give her a crown. Sure. Where was, where was the bangs there? Oh, oh, I like this. There, this one, right? This is what we wanted. Nah, bangs. Massive ears behind the hair. You got it. I don't think they'll ever show up, but just in case they do, they'll, they'll come back with a jump scare. Ear size all the way. Someone had asked for lipstick, but I don't think, I don't think that's an option. Mouth. Yeah, no, but we can give her an underbite. Sure, I'm feeling that. You feeling that? Give her a bit of an underbite. Hey, Kairu. Welcome in. Uh, as you can tell, I am not Lucky Blue. I am his older brother. Uh, he convinced me to do this today. This is our big April Fools. Big lips do. All right, you got it. You. Oh, that's not even that big. Uh, she, she's looking kind of Neanderthal now. Uh, someone said green eyes. Let's go back to that. Eye color. That's a pretty good looking green, right? 
There it is. Okay, you got red hair, green eyes, Neand Neanderthal chin. Anything else? Yeah, Blue is in the other room. Uh, Blue is literally uh, in his bedroom behind me uh, as backup in case anything goes horribly wrong. Uh, he actually set all this up for me. I have no idea how like any of this works, so he just said, can I have your computer? I gave him my computer for like half an hour, and he's like, all right, you're good to go, and show me a bunch of buttons. Um, this is more complex than I gave it credit for. Uh, make her fabulous. All right. Let's see. Oh, we also gave her a big nose. Where was that? Nose. What we had, right? Big old nose. Who is actually holding the gun? Yeah, he's he's right behind me. It's loaded. If I don't stream for a full three hours, uh, Mobile Suit of Bridge Gundam Wing is over. Every makeup option available. You got it. Uh, I thought there was. Oh, I think it's under skin. Oh, oh, blue. Sure. Why not? Oh, here we go. Lip color. There was. Okay, we had said lipstick. What? What color lipstick are we going for? Yeah, Haruka, we got lipstick. Lip intensity. Okay. All right. Now we're getting into like clown, clown territory. Let's see. Eyeshadow intensity. Oh, you can't even see it because of the bangs. We can also go with facial tattoos, or just like freckles, I guess. I, I like the freckles. We're going with some freckles. Whatever looks worst against the orange hair. Yeah. Oh, uh, this is going to be a pain to see, like, every time. Let's get skin complete. Oh, oh. Oh, this. Just make her old and wrinkly. Or, like, dead, I guess. Zombie. Purple lipstick? What's purple look like? Oh, oh, oh. There we go. We got purple. Uh, I kind of like that one. What do we think? Someone's suffering from scurvy there. Yeah. Let's see. Wasn't there... Blush intensity. Blush color. Oh, more purple? So she's just, like, raving down here and, like, Pippi Lawn stalking up here. You know what's funny, Gray? I've only heard Femhawk voice come out of the default female voice, so this is gonna feel strange. Yeah, so actually, um, uh, in the, like, free DLC that came with it, you, uh, can go to this place where you can, uh, edit your facial features and stuff in a mirror. Uh, when I first got this game for PS3, so I had already gotten all the achievements in Xbox, I decided to get it, uh, for PS3 for, like, ten bucks, and I thought, I'll just play it again. And I thought, I'm gonna change uh, how she looks and, and you know, do do different things. I got, like, maybe three hours into the story and thought, ah, this is weird, and just went back to default. Uh, one of the cool things about the game is since uh, the rest of the family is your, like, biological family, it takes some attributes from what you make and tries to apply those to the rest of your family members. So uh, Bethany and Carver and Leandra are also gonna look, like, a little bit different based on this. I don't think they'll have purple lipstick, but we'll see what happens. All right, so let's see. Give her a big M tattoo on her eye. Uh, I don't think I can. Where, where we got tattoos? Oh, those must be uh, uh, broken mods. Let's see. These are all the facial tattoos we've got. Do we want? Do we want a tattoo or no? It might be too much. The <laughs> Street Fighter Six feature. Dude, the Street Fighter 6 character creator is so fun. Actually, the, the first one I made was Hawk, because that's just kind of what I do. Jack is saying old. Jack thinks that, uh, that we should go with the old face. Maybe not too old. Give her some stubble. I, that's not even old. That's just... That's, that's a zombie. You know, I agree. Blue, you don't get a vote. You can do this in your own stream. You you stream Dragon Age 2 on your own time. This is mine. Okay, so we'll do we'll do a little bit older. I'm not feeling the tattoo. Are you guys feeling the tattoo? Go with freckles? Yeah, I agree. We're going with the freckles. The freckles are cute. We're not going full on abomination today. We're we're just we're just gonna have a little bit of fun with it. The, the purple lipstick sells it. You are hanging out with Brutus. 
I'm gonna start like pounding the floor with my feet so that uh, he just barks randomly. There isn't a whisker tattoo, Hobbs. I'm sorry. Okay, I think we're gonna go with this. I think this is good. Uh, you can also change the portrait, make her make her look different. I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna highlight the veins a bit. Yeah, there we go. Bangs. All right, there we go. That's gonna be that's gonna be there every time that uh, that we see her up in the corner. Background doesn't even matter. All right. Uh, actually, do we have purple? I think there's a purple one. Ah, damn. There's no purple. Oh well. Okay. And then, oh, name. We got we got a name or something. What are we naming our chat? No, nothing that'll get me demonetized. All right, so almost Aruka, but different. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Just misspelling. I don't know. Why not? Intern Gunbuster, Nutella, Crave with an A, Greyhawk. Ah, uh, ad friendly. Nope. Oh, if I could type, Emma Stone Fist, Bob Johnson. Juhani. <laughs> Raid Shadow Legends. Can it fit? Oh, I can't fit. It can't fit. That would have been funny. Nut. Nut Hawk. I don't know. I'm feeling nut. We gonna go with nut? Nut Hawk. Uh, I like it. So here's where you would import your, uh, your game. I don't have any, so I'm not gonna, like, really bother. Um, Young Daily Shelf. da da da, -da. Dwarven Noble. You know what? I think I, I think I'll go with the Martyr. I always like the Elves. Falcon Hawk, because she is not Hawk. <laughs> uh do do do. Raven, Falcon. Yeah, I We'll we'll pick a bird. Um Swallow? Is that how you spell swallow? I actually don't know. I don't know if it's a different spelling. Uh, bo booby hawk. Hmm. No, I kind of like I kind of like the bird thing. We'll go with the. Uh, you know what? Hops. We'll go. We'll go with Raven. She looks like a raven. She, she's got she's got the uh, Teen Titans raven colors going on. <laughs> Please don't name her swallow. Yeah, I, I realized it as soon as I said it. I was thinking the bird swallow. Okay, but yeah, we'll we'll give we'll give Hobbs this one. Hobbs wins. It's it's Raven. It's because I like Hobbs. Okay, we good we good with this. This is Hawk now. Booby is a bird. You're right. You're right. Okay, let's go ahead and start the game. It's gonna go on normal, so I don't like die and we have to reset whole eras. The blight been unleashed on Ferelden. Dark spawn poured out of the wilds, clashing against the army at the ruins of Ostagar. So this is very briefly giving you was a disaster. A recap King of the King first game on the field with his men, betrayed by his most trusted general. Yeah, this is this is like fantasy as fuck. This game actually kind of got me into fantasy before it I was way more of a sci-fi guy. Still am. The village burned, and many innocents were slaughtered. You do that, Hobbs. The champion's family. You can look up the. Uh, you can look up the VOD and do the exact same thing I did. <laughs> Explain what the fuck this open intro scene means, but do it poorly. Um, man, putting me on the spot. <laughs> Varric for counting his fan fiction. I don't know. Oh, they didn't change. It's probably because I have mods. Shoot. I think that's Normally they, they, like, change some facial structure and, like, hair colors and stuff. Make us save us. I was hoping they'd First all be, like, all. bright red gingers. Alright, we go, we staying sarcastic or being mean. You can also be a good girl. Eric paints a picture with only color. I'm gonna keep going sarcastic. At least we're alive. That's no small feat. Yes, 
Thank you, Zeno Wings. Right. Signalis is great. We should have run it is so Why good. Did we wait so long? Why are you looking at us? We've been running since Ostagar. Odd Builder says there's a good, but there's also a renegade for life. Yeah. Not to interrupt. But the blight's not going to wait while we stand here pointing fingers. It's also kind of awkward when you're deciding, like, everyone in character is just waiting for you to talk and standing silently just staring at you. Think about it from their perspective. Oh, yeah, I have a dog, by the way. We get to name that later. Yeah, I, I, have, a, I have a good little boy. All right, get, getting used to the PC controls. I miss my controller. Oh, and now because uh, we're actually starting it, I'm not broken like I was before. I have exactly two commands, and one of them is to spawn my dog. Riveting gameplay. Let's see. Pick up this. Wait, where are we going? People name the dog cat. I don't know. I'm thinking Brutus. Where else? And then where? Oh wait, do not we name the dog Paprika. Wander. Sounds like we're gonna name the dog Paprika. Yeah, we're gonna name him Paprika. Jake, <laughs> Jake. No, you know what? Uh, Jake from State Farm. Double joke. So long as we wander aimlessly away from the horde, I'm happy. The blush is killing me. It looks like she has lights, like where her ears are. Oh, you can barely see her ears. They're enormous. Of Templars in Kirkwall, Mother. I know that, but we still have family there, and an estate. Ah, then we need to get to Guaran and take ship. If we survive that long, I'll just be happy to get out of here. I knew this would happen. Now we meet Aveline. I love her. I should have just taken her hair, actually. <laughs> A gender who loves to cut people. Are you sure this is in Scotland? You will not have him. They will not have you. Thanks, I Not couldn't tell when you said it out loud earlier. The world's straightest lesbian. Yeah, uh, in, in Bioware games, a lot of characters are, like, you know, romanceable, so you can uh, start a relationship with them. Aveline is, like, strictly hands-off, and, uh, like, it makes me sad. She has a, a whole extra story about, like, like, I don't know. There's a whole lot later in the game, but I love her. See, how do I switch between characters? I'm actually curious. I just click. All right, there we go. Ah, this is hard. There we go. Okay. Stop squirming, Wesley. You'll make it worse. Again, just covered in blood through all of these conversations. I love it. Has a sense of humor. Darkspawn and now a Templar. I thought they all abandoned Lothering. The spawn are clear in their intent. Also, I apologize. There's a lot of lore that they're just, like, going over here. He's a Templar. Templars don't like people who do magic. My sister does magic. That's all that's happening here. The order dictates. And then you get sized up by a red-headed clown. They explain the mage racism. I don't have enough time. I'd have to make a whole separate video. This is my husband, Sir Wesley. We can hate each other when we're safe from the Horde. You're quick to offer your allegiance. Another blade between. He us was a Templar Lord. boy. She said, "See yes, you please. later, boy." So long as the Horde is their first. Mage, uh, mage racism is just is that mages can be. Uh, tempted or taken over by demons. Normal people cannot in the same way, so no one likes mages. Mages, however, can conjure fire and ice and are, like, super cool. So I know which side I'm on. 
Okay, are we going uh, good to these nice people we just met, uh, mean to them to keep them in their place, or uh, easing everything with another joke? Because so far we've only picked joke. The normal then, yeah. It, it's it's kind of like uh, X-Men, how they weren't allowed to really depict like racism at the time, so they had to create mutants and then create fake racism so they could tell their stories without being culturally insensitive. Uh, a lot of these D&D related things do the same thing either with elves or mages, like to sort of like supplant that and then you can insert in your own like group in your imagination. Also, everyone is waiting on me to give an answer. I don't know why. Make her funny, only do sarcasm. Okay, all right. We're getting basically no votes but sarcasm. More so their wives. But as long as there is a greater danger, you and I have an accord. Thank you, Wesley. For now, we move with you. North is cut off. We barely escaped the main body of the Horde. Then we're trapped. No, since I've been talking, I may have, like, glossed over all this. We're all just trying to get away from this, uh, horde of Darkspawn. Like, essentially, it's like a zombie apocalypse right now. And we're just running away from home and have no idea where we're going. Do you play TTR uh, RPGs? Uh, so in person, no. Um, I actually never have. Uh, where I grew up, like no one ever played them. And uh, by the time I moved out here, I was like older than almost all my friends and never really like joined them. So uh, I never have. Hey, let's light them on fire. You know, this party's really redundant because now we have three warriors all just, like, swinging our swords in the exact same way. Oh, poor Bethany. No. Okay. Back to Bethany. Oh, whoops. Uh, sure. Why not? Let's go ahead and do this now. Uh, we will give her... Hmm. Heal, so I don't... So I don't fuck up. We'll, we'll say she can heal. Uh, strength, sure. Give him, uh... Give him this guy. Oh, I can't. Never mind. Yeah, this is this is the riveting gameplay that you all came here for. Uh, we'll go with Constitution and Strength, and I'm gonna stick with my uh, two-handed weapons. Those those are fun. Those are always Blue's favorite, so we're doing we're doing it for Blue. I love that my dog just comes around and, like, just just bites anything I'm attacking. Like, yeah, sure, let's go for it. And then just kind of meanders off whenever we're done. He doesn't know what he's doing. Just like Brutus. Now we fight. Oh, Argon's here! <laughs> it's, it's not Skyrim, and you know that. I actually have never played Skyrim. Just, just not much of a, uh, an Elder Scrolls guy. Oh, gotta go protect my baby sister. There we go. Just like real life. I have to think so much harder when I'm not playing on controller. Is this what PC gamers feel like when they pick up like an Xbox controller? Because I feel like I'm relearning the game. I don't even know how to like regularly move. Like how do you how do you move with only these these uh keys? Ah, see, I can't even like pick this up. There we go. Naturally, you all have to see me be bad at a game. It's not nearly as fun whenever I'm like actually good at it. So Gray, would you want a sci-fi TTRPG or a fantasy one to play? Um, I would go with sci-fi. So even though like I love Dragon Age, it's not necessarily because of the sci-fi part, same or uh, the fantasy part, same with Baldur's Gate. Um, I am a, a sci-fi guy at heart, but like these specific stories suck me in. So like the world of Dragon Age and the world of Baldur's Gate 3, well, Baldur's Gate in general, I've only ever played one, not two. Um, but uh, you know, those fascinate me, but fantasy itself has always been like lower than, than sci-fi. I would rather uh, watch Star Wars and Lord of the Rings, for instance. Um, but yeah, like, I, I know those exist. There's some with, like, mecha in them and stuff. Like, those sound really cool, but I haven't actually done them. 
Stop hitting me. Alright, swap to Bethany. This is just more of what I know how to play. I love that we did just bangs. That cracks me up every time I go to click on it. God, she's so slow. I'm so used to a rogue. Like when I was testing this game out, putting in the mods and stuff, I actually went rogue. Uh, and kind of remembered like how that played. Before they regroup, we must press towards the wilds. Not going. Ah, uh, no, none of us are rogues. Ah, why does the game give like if you pick, <laughs> if you pick a warrior, you just get three warriors to start off? Oh, that's just mean. You're just like those anti prototypes with the bane's covering the eyes. Oh God. Oh no. Oh, I don't I don't wanna be. Can can I not? Is there some other bangs I I'm just, you know, early two thousands uh Zoe de Chanel or something. I'll take that instead. Alright. So now we're actually playing the part that Varric had exaggerated earlier where we have to fight this uh ogre. It's kind of a it's kind of a nice thing. Hope too late, man. No, Carver! We were so attached to you! All those antics. R remember when Carver said, "There's that's no way out? That was my favorite part. Oh, okay. This is significantly harder than when he was embellishing. There we go. Get him, dog. Oh, she already healed. Uh, all right. Okay, if I can just finish him off, then we'll get to the cutscene. I think. Nope, okay. Things McGee, let's go. Save your sister. There we go. By the way, I, I don't know if I actually said it, but thank you, Argon, for coming. I was told that you were at a beach? Is that right? Or was I getting confused with one of the other regulars? But Blue's here in the chat. You can keep make fun of, making fun of him like usual. You don't have to make fun of me. Okay, I don't think I'll die. I think I'll be fine. There we go. See, everything's fine. I did it. Wake up. The battle's over. You should call the dog What's Up. I don't know. I was pretty sold on Paprika, but what's up is pretty good. No, these things will not take cover. Okay, so my brother just died. Am I still going to be kind of like charming, sarcastic, or am I going to be <laughs> mean to my mom? Or am I going to like, you know, not speak ill of the dead? Which one are we going with? Because I feel like I should not speak ill of the dead, but I feel like these would be more fun options. I don't know, I could be mean. Okay, even more sarcastic, you got it. Now, it changed a bit, so it's charming instead of sarcastic, but sure, I guess I never liked Maybe my brother. Grieve when we're safe. Don't speak to me of grief. This is your fault. How, How? can you let him charge off like that? Your little brother. My little boy. You know, it just hit me that I almost you. always pick an option where Carver dies, but I have a little brother, and he's in the room behind me. I wonder if there's some kind of subconscious... Ashes we were, and ashes we become. Should, I, should I stop picking this option? Let us take comfort in the peace he has found in eternity. So yeah, what the game does to even out your numbers is you start with... Uh, your little brother who's a warrior and your little sister who's a mage. If you pick mage as an option, then uh, your sister will actually die at this part so that you don't have two mages. Um, 
if uh, you pick either of the other ones, then Carver dies. But at least Father will have company now. The, the purple lipstick is killing me. I can't believe we picked that. When I die, Flint. please let a magic You're racist read my holy rites, even though I wouldn't want him to. Oh god. Too real. Too real. I don't like that. On the day after Easter, no less. Which apparently, like... No one celebrates it the way they do Christmas, because I swear nothing was closed on Easter. I had to work on Easter, my friends had to work on Easter. I wanted to get, like, Mexican food, and that was open on Easter. Alright, now we're back to this part. Zeno, so, wait, in order to fill a class slot, they kill someone of that class 40? Yes. So, this opening... Uh, one of your siblings die, but then it, it kills the one that you don't have a class for. So if I picked a mage class, I would play through the entire game with Carver alive. If I pick a non-mage class, I play through the entire game uh, with Bethany alive. Um, it, it's kind of a neat wrinkle, and it makes sure that you have um, some skin in the game with the mage versus Templar like theme that the entire game is going for. It's making sure that you have some magic person related to you if you are not magic speaking of magic people well, well here's Flemeth. what have we here dragon gills yep a uh, fun fact my ex from like seven years ago cosplayed as uh Flemeth. not while we were dating though so don't get any ideas but she loved her costume design and decided to make it Impressive. Where'd you learn how to turn into a dragon? Perhaps I am a dragon. <laughs> the it's only so thing not hot about Flemeth is her name. Yeah. Darkspawn does nothing with the appetite. If you wish to flee the Darkspawn, you should know you are heading in the wrong direction. I'm sorry. Wait. Empire. It's me. not Dragon's Dogma 2. I really should have thought about that when I picked yeah, this game, not. like, the week that Dragon's Dogma comes out. Oops. I guess that's the April Fools. You all thought it was Dragon's Dogma 2. Ha ha. Who could perform such a feat? But now my curiosity is sated and you are safe for the moment. Is that not enough? You could show me that trick of yours. That looks useful. Okay, I'm actually starting to love her hair the more that we if play this. Clever tongue was all one needed. Tell me, clever child. How do you intend to outrun the Blight? We need to get to Kirkwall, in the Free Marches. Kirkwall? My, but that is quite the voyage you plan. Your king will not miss you, hmm? I'm sure he'll miss his life more. <laughs> oh, you I like. Yeah, Blue's right. Flynn is just like, oh, usually people are afraid of me. You're cracking jokes? You're cool. I'll tell you the real April Fool's joke, Argon and his freaking invisibility. Is it fate? Are you like trying to find Argon, Sato? Argon will show when he wants to be seen. It appears fortune smiles on us both today. I may be able to help you yet. I guess I'll stop asking. We're just going to go like sarcastic and charming the whole way through, yeah? I'll, I'll, I'll ask it things when I think uh, another option's good. There must be a catch. <laughs> there is always a catch. Life is a catch. I suggest you catch it while you can. Maybe we shouldn't trust her. I don't even know what she is. I know what she is. The Witch of the Wilds. Some call me that. Also Purple eyes drop a video? No, I haven't. An old hag who talks too much. Why is Dragon Gilf talking to her? Does it matter? Uh, I she, you this. she has a favor that she I wants. I'll get your group past the horde in exchange for a simple delivery to a place not far out of your way. Would you do this for a Witch of the Wilds? Essentially, she came and saved us from a, like, huge horde and now is asking for something in return. Should we trust her? Wesley Dragon Gilf has a way of meeting every spawn. player character in every game. If you need to. Leave me behind. No. 
I said I would drag you out if I had to, and I meant it. I think I got you a new subscriber. Thank you, Caretaker Studios. Five dollars and a new subscriber? You're the MVP today. What is a witch of the wilds exactly? A chastened legend. Witches that steal children. Bah, as if I had nothing better to do. <laughs> You're an apostate? Yes. I love that she doesn't even outright refute it. She's like, why would I steal children? I have better shit to do. You would go through all that trouble to have something delivered. My last Uber ride. I have. You know, I'm uh, I'm always happy to hear that you have our things running while you're doing Uber, but you're driving safely, right? You're not like watching this while you're driving because if one day you suddenly like aren't in the stream, I'm going to like really worry. Is she a romance in the game? No, she's not. Flemeth is not a romance option. I'm sorry. Roast a few more ducks. Her daughter is though, do just not this one. Sadly, my charity is at an end. There is a clan of Danish elves near the city of Kirkwall. Deliver this amulet to their keeper, Marathari. Do as she asks with it, and any debt between us is paid in full. Before I take you anywhere, however, there is another matter. Oh, Sato! Thank you for watching. I, I genuinely appreciate that everybody, like, Saul Blue wasn't here and then didn't immediately close out. <laughs> within his blood already. You lie. She's right, Aveline. I can feel the corruption inside me. Uh, Haruka says, so gray, mecha, TTRPG, regular sci-fi, or super robot. Uh, I would probably, like, if I were presented all three choices, go with a regular sci-fi, but a mecha one would also be pretty cool. I don't know. I think I would go, like, a regular sci-fi so I can get out what my, like, uh... Mass Effect, Star Wars, Star Trek side. Oh yeah, I guess we should do this, so... Yeah, there are a bunch of dialogue options they have where you can, like, learn stuff you would have learned in the first game. I recently replayed Dragon Age Origins. It would be hard to stream. The The graphics are very dated. But it's, it's a great story. This corruption is the permanent sort, I take it. The only cure I know of is to become a Grey Warden. And they all died at Ostagar. Not all. When do you meet Felicia Day? Uh, you meet Felicia Day later on when we get to the part where we can pick DLC. Uh, if, if I continue to stream, if this isn't a one-time thing and we continue doing this, I will happily get to the Felicia Day part. Please, the corruption is a Or we could do a Movie Night Mondays of the awful, like, uh, LARPing uh, Dragon Age movie or series? I forget. I've got it on DVD somewhere. I picked it up for like two bucks. Uh, I watched it when it first came out and it's not great. <laughs> no, these graphics are not up to date, but the Origins is honestly much worse. Blue will vouch. He's your husband, Evelyn. I can't decide his fate. This was like a huge jump up at the time. You asked Blue to make him play more mecha games. Blue, make, uh, play more mecha games. There. Best I could do. Dragon Age has never been, like, a, a pinnacle of visuals. This was on their own proprietary uh, graphics engine that they made with um, uh, Edge of Reality. It was really just something that they could make on a lower budget. But with this game, they tried a little bit more. Things like, you know, hair moving more, um, uh, uh, detailed environments more, um, animations than the other one. Uh, Origins is a very ugly game, but a great, great story. It gets no easier. Your struggles have only just begun. I love these transitions, by the way. I wish they had more of them in the game. You expect me to believe a myth swooped out of the wild to save the champion? Oh, come now, Seeker. Do I need to recite the tale of the Warden as well? No. Perhaps I shouldn't be surprised to hear... I'm just now realizing just how many references to the first game there are. Too. I never really think about it when I'm playing what through. What else aren't you telling me, then? Did she send someone with the champion? In a matter of speaking. So it's true. 
Continue. But if you tell me they all flew to Kirkwall on a dragon... Nothing so fanciful. <laughs> Dreadful is the GTA 6 of Dragon Age. Prove me wrong. Uh, I will prove you wrong. GTA 6, they've shown gameplay. Like, they have a trailer saying, like, it will actually come out at some point. Dreadwolf, I'm pretty sure, is just, like, some sort of tax fraud scheme. I don't I don't know that it actually exists. In fact, today's April Fool's. They're just going to announce that Dreadwolf was never a thing. Dark hold, packed in with the fearful and the desperate. <laughs> actually, Blue brings up a good point. Uh, in Dragon Age 2, she didn't have a scar. But then in Inquisition, she Long has a scar, and it's from something that happened in her teens. So I modded it to put it back in, but it's always weird when it goes back to a like pre-rendered one, and she just got like a perfectly fine face. It's a free city, but I use the word loosely. Ooh, there's a Robotech tabletop RPG. Really? The gallows, welcoming you. That's where their ship Caretaker landed. Studios gave five dollars for the next five minutes. Play this game as Wu Fei. Oh boy. Okay, so I got to go until three forty-one in character. Ah, <laughs> oh, crap! They're all women. Oh no. Okay. All right. Okay. <clears throat> sure. You got it, Caretaker Studios. For five dollars, I'll do that. <laughs> well, there goes our monetization. And only level strength. <laughs> uh, fine. Bethany needs to be stronger anyway. You're all weaklings. I'm not going to get canceled. You're going to get canceled. What was the line I really... You stupid fucker. There we go. Oh god, they're city. all women. What? That can't be. It's true. Look at them all. <laughs> Why did I agree to be Wu Fei when all the characters in the party are women? They're Fereldans just like us. Fleeing for their lives. And they would throw us all back to the wolves. Unbelievable. Wolves aren't a problem, just yell at them. I guess those were hyenas. I'm only surprised they let us dock. We need to find Gamlin. Our family has always been highly regarded in Kirkwall. He can do something, I'm sure of it. But was he the strongest in Kirkwall? I think not. Reporting to that man. Perhaps we should speak to him. Yeah, I am magic racist. It's bullshit that they have fire. Why don't they just learn swordsmanship like me? Out of my way, weaklings. Get back to the crowd, you lot. You get Try back to, to the crowd. Way through won't get you into Kirkwall any faster. But you do intend to let us in. <laughs> we have enough. <laughs> I can think of so many things Wufei would say, and I don't want to say you any of them. I don't want to call any of these nice ladies a bitch. I heard someone call this fortress the Gallows. Is it a prison? <laughs> Yeah, I am magic racist because I can't do magic. It's cheating. I don't heal. I just hit harder. Yeah, lock up the mages. Well, no more than anywhere else. Where's Nataku? Magic is to serve man, not rule him. And mages are better. Nataku is an extension of my own strength. It counts. <laughs> There must be someone in charge I can speak with. Yes, yes, always the same story. These bitches always be talking. Captain Yuald. I'm just here to keep you refuse from climbing the walls. Thank you. Now we can progress the plot. Why are they letting anyone in? Was Wesley based out of the Lothar's Chantry? I don't remember ever seeing him there. Is now really the so time? Were, he just he died. To find me at Ostagar. Were you familiar with every Templar and Lothering? How else was I supposed Catch to up, Mom to Jesus. That, that 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 was quite the strut. You try you trying to catch the eyes of the guards over here? It doesn't look 
Let us through, you flaming blighter. Oh yeah, now we get to fight. Then get back on your ship and leave. Kirkwall has no would more be a mage? Yeah, Trace would be a mage. Already gone. He already concocts bullshit here. plans that make you no sense. May as well be there's magic. I can do. The city is full. Surely there's a bit of extra room for the pretty people. <laughs> I find keeping my neck away from a knight commander Meredith's blade far more attractive than any of you. That line hits different when she's got purple months. lipstick. You're too late. There's no more room. But we have family here. Doesn't that mean anything? I've heard claims like that a thousand times already. Trust me. We'll find some ships to take you all back to Ferelden eventually. Until then, you stay here. Kinji tell by Wupei. I need healing! God damn it, where's the healer? I had them in that 1v5, but you just didn't heal me. If you find our uncle, Gamlin Amel, you might just have a few less refugees bothering you. Gamlin? I know that name. He's a nobleman here in the city. Our family has an estate. A nobleman? The only Gamlin I know is a weasel who couldn't rub two coppers together. He comes back, I'll bring you to him. But I don't have time to... Whoa. I like his you slick back hair. Fun. I didn't say got a cowlick up here. We've been here for four days. They just got here. That's it. We're carving our way out of here. Men? Finally, we get to fight. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. And fuck you. Where's Trace? Oh, call my dog. Get out here, Nataku. Oh my god, we're naming the dog Nataku. <laughs> Nothing but strength, you got it. <laughs> I don't know that that's worth five dollars, but here we go. Okay, now, now you get to make people freeze. And then, uh... Let's see... If I go with... All right, back to fighting. Get her, Nataku. Or him. We don't fight women or weaklings. Good thing. Good thing everyone here is a man. That determines what I'm allowed to fight. I got if someone just joins while I'm like in character and like, oh, his voice is annoying, and also he's he's a, <laughs> he's a misogynist jerk. Captain, I love that. Right? Unbelievable. I no thanks to you. Where is everyone? Go find them. I want this. He like suddenly control. channels his inner George Decay. My thanks. Look, I can't get you into the city. It's not all right. Decision. Wufe time is over. Find your uncle. Now, now I can treat all of these women like the wonderful people they are. <laughs> and also, he's like weirdly sexist. <laughs> When do we get Wufe plays the YouTube series? Honestly, so we want to do more YouTube, but sure we have full-time jobs. Like, uh, this past week, I actually worked six, 67 hours. Not, so, like, the whole reason that Episode 1 and Episode 8 still aren't back on Vimeo uh, is I have not had time or energy after work to, like, fix them. If at some point we become full-time YouTubers, Leandra, we'll make whatever you want. I would love to play games as Wufe and just immediately get canceled. But uh, right now, we just kind of find our days off. This is my only day off Let until Saturday, front, so that's this. that's but why we don't make husband. tons and tons of content. We want to get there, though. I'd, uh, figured you'd pretty much be for life. So this is our Uncle Gamlin. Oh, Gamlin. He sucks. We came to he's, 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 he's this game's oh, Wufe, but not, like, he doesn't have the cool features to, to fix Leandra, that. He's, like, all of the bad parts of Wufe. I don't even know if I can help you get in. Would it help if I said you were my favorite uncle? <laughs> it would make me feel better, but that's about it. I was hoping to grease some palms, but the night oh, commander... Oh shit, Kenji, Overwatch, Grace. I can't, I can't say that. 
I can't even attempt. I don't play. I don't play Genji. I just heal him. Right about the estate, it's um gone to settle a debt. I've been meaning to write you. Then there's no. Yeah, so we came to the city because our mom used to live here and had like a big estate when she ran away. Her brother uh gambled it away. So now we, we got here, found out that we lost everything, and now we have to uh, work under, like, indentured servitude for a year. Mother said our family was wealthy. You really can't help us. I am blighted helping. I've got two offers of work from people who've got the coin to open those gates. Crazy to most of the world how many hours Americans work and how little time off they get. Yeah. Uh, that's actually the whole reason I work six, seven hours. Uh, Blue and I took a family vacation uh, to see family, and uh, I didn't want to use all of my vacation time in March, considering there's still nine months left. So the week before we went on vacation, uh, I worked a ton of overtime, and the week after we got home from vacation, I worked a ton of overtime. So I worked seven days straight. Uh, to pay for that. So, like, everything's good, but I was exhausted. Um, I want to work on more YouTube stuff this week, but, uh, yeah, that's, that's how we Americans do it, I guess. Let's hear it, Uncle. What do you have in mind? If you imagine an Overwatch fighting game, but Genji players are 102% exactly the same are in your shooters, they, they'll quit on every single game they're about to lose. You'll never get a win from them. For a year. A year? It's the best I could do. Trust me when I say a bunch of refugees won't get a better option anywhere else. I'm sure we'll be free and clear before we know it. I managed to convince my contacts to come I feel to like I should start being mean person. to Gamlin because, like, Mere by joking, I'm indirectly being nice, and I kind of just want to shit on him. For recruits. Like, just be mean to him all the time. I guess you might call her a smuggler. Either one of them can help you. All you need to do is find them in the courtyard and convince them you're worth Oh god, if it has a win streak feature like in Street Fighter 6, that'll be gone. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think about this, Bethany? We've come this far. Bethany's a little cinnamon bun. I don't care bun. who we work for, as long as it means we don't have to go back. The funny thing is, like, I don't pick Mage as often because I want Bethany to live. Uh, I like her better than Carver. I'm so glad I'm not Wu Fei now because I can say that. Because Wufei would be like, Carver, my best bro! Let's be mean to people together. And then each other. Let's find them and see what they have to say. Oh, Gamlin, I don't know about this. It's a lot of coin. Gamlin looks like he's constantly got a dog. Don't go expecting uh, name to carry got caught the pooping on the couch, yeah. To. And what of me? I will not allow others to incur debts on my behalf. <laughs> Can't see that it makes a difference. You look like a lady who can pull her own weight. Then you're hey, that's my new best friend. I have no real option. Thank you. Wufei well, does like someone. He likes Nataku. Let's see. Uh, go with the smuggler. Actually, wait, no. I'm I'm big sword lady. I should go with the uh, one that kills people. Yeah, so here you get to pick yeah. who your, like, faction is at the start for this, like, year of work. But uh, the game nice. was actually made in only 16 months, so I think this entire part was just kind of skipped over. You're basically you. just picking your, he not be blowing more smoke like, option for a, a side quest later. Getting us into the city will take a lot of coin. <laughs> Did I Normal Kenji players are leffing. Yeah... Much. Not to mention your uncle said your sister's a mage. We're willing to pay for that. Oh no. Who does this hawk look like? Florence and the machine! She does! We accidentally made Florence! The Oh, oh my god, are we naming our dog the machine now? Apparently Uncle Gamlin likes to talk. You stick with us. You'll be safe. For a year, at least. My uncle doesn't seem like the sort to hang out with mercenaries. He doesn't. Gamlin cheated one of my men at a wallop match. You turn out, we'll call it even. I'll find some other way into the city. 
Let me know how that works out for you. All right, I just want to go meet the other person. You guys can pick. It doesn't actually make a large difference on the game, but we'll pick either the guy who kills people or the girl who steals from people. Are uh, you a Senra? He must be Gamlin's niece. Interesting. I don't know what he told you about us, but he certainly told us a great deal about you. He didn't say anything about me, did you? Can't believe we accidentally made Florence and the machine. Yeah, we're naming the dog the machine. That's what we're going with. I hear getting us into the city isn't cheap. If you're as good as your uncle claims, we're hoping you'll be worth it. After all, it's not every day we're offered an apostate services. Does everyone know about us? If the circle hasn't descended upon you, my guess is no. The Templars in Kirkwall like to think they have all mages properly leashed, but when has that ever been true? We can keep them from taking notice while you're with us. Wouldn't be the first time. Okay, so chat, are we How going with the smugglers or the killers? We either do like mercenary work and just kill some people, or we do some mercenary work and steal from people. What are we going with? If you turn out though, we'll consider things even. I'll find some other way into the city. Suit yourself. I'll be around for a bit, if you change your mind. Can't leash a mage. Uh, the Kunari disagree. Oh, and Blue, the, uh, the, uh, female walking animation is also even weirder because I have the, uh, uh, 1.5 speed up. So this game, like, I swear it makes you run slower to make the world feel bigger. So I added a mod that lets me go a little faster, but it makes every NPC animation and everything, like, go twice as fast. So everyone looks kind of weird when they run. I, it might only be jarring for me because I'm used to the regular game. What would Wufei choose? Wufei would definitely choose killing people. He's not going to steal. He's he's just going to kill them. So I, guess, I guess we'll go with this one. Not not that I'm still playing the game in character yeah, in Wufei yeah. unless you guys keep still feeding me $5 every five minutes. I'm ready to prove myself. Noble snuggling. <laughs> snuggling. Uh, if, if, if I could get into a city just by snuggling for a year, I'd do it. Now he's hiding out here, waiting for a ship. He sees us coming, he run for sure. But he Yeah, you haul ass a bit. Uh, you can actually turn it all the way up to three. I have it at 1.5. You can just like speed through. I thought, isn't this? Ah, oh, there it is. He's still out there, but he's alone. And he's not making a move. I don't trust this. What will we do when the ship comes? Wait, who are you? I demand to know what you're doing here. What's his name again? I want to check for it. Uh, the guy I was just talking to? Uh, you know what? I'll know in just a second. I know the name of the, uh, Root, but I can't remember his name. You know what? We're woo -faying it. Fair question, really. To shut you up. Mirren sent you. Mirren, there you go. Mirren. Oh, the Uncle Gamlin. Uncle Gamlin. No? I keep, like, forgetting the controls. Hit him. There we go. Okay, cool. Got it. It feels like when I tried to get into TF2, I tried really hard for, like, a week to get used to mouse and keyboard controls, and I was just awful. Get him, boy. Get him, the machine. All right. He's dead. Oh, uh, Zinnawing. Sorry, I got distracted. Uh, Uncle Gamlin. Uh, he's, he's been in other things. I thought, I thought you meant this guy, Mirren. For the, uh, the Red Brigade or whatever they're called. Dead and buried. Well, dead. Dirt. <laughs> May the bloody vultures feast on his corpse and shit him into the ocean. Welcome to the Red Eye. You know, Titanfall, uh, Haruka, is actually a game I've always wanted to try and never did. I think I actually own it because it was on, like, Super Sale for $5 or something. All right, attributes. Let's, see, let's go with... Uh... 
I still can't get those? Fine, whatever. Alright. Paprika Jack said, only strength for Bethany. This, <laughs> She's gonna be a completely useless mage. Like, at some point, I won't even be able to use these anymore. Jack, I don't think this is worth $5. <laughs> let's see. Uh, let's give... Haste. There we go. And... Yeah, I'm just kind of, like, going through this stuff without really talking. Figure it's not that, uh, fun to watch me going through menus. Alright, let's see. Now, I talk to this guy, I think? So, that was your uncle, was it? Good. I thought he was another confidence man trying to sell promises. I don't suppose he... <laughs> has he never one stops one. the grind. You know, I wish that, like, she would just start getting more muscular as you add more strength, and she's just, like, hawked out, like, uh, the end of that one Rick and Morty episode. X gonna give it to you. He had some ideas. Mm, they always do. If it were just up to me, I'd let you through. <laughs> See what happens is the Templar takes her staff and they're like, ha, oh, she's powerless, and then she just beats their asses. Yeah. The next city hasn't already closed their doors. Nothing what <laughs> Paprika, the <laughs> She still has no health. I'm not gonna give her any constitution. Anything breathes on her, she'll fall over. I guess I'm just gonna like equip her with a sword. Okay. Where's Gamlin? Gamlin? I lost him. Gamlin. When when did I walk past you? Any luck? Was there ever any doubt? I'll speak to Mirren and see when the bribes can be made. Wait here. Never say an episode of Rick and Morty. Look, Rick and Morty is a good show. It doesn't have good fans. Like, if someone walks up to you with a pickle Rick shirt, probably not a great conversation starter, but it's a good show. No more running for our lives unless we really have to. If only Carver were here with us. Oh, yeah, bring him up. Won't shut up about your dead son. Well, we're off to a fantastic start. Also, Gray, I was serious about running you. Aw, thank you, Aruka. You know what? We'll, we'll look into that because I know that uh, Blue has been wanting to do uh, some tabletops again. Thus he and his friends used to. Um, yeah, we've got that in the Minecraft server we have to do. Uh, I still haven't joined that because I don't know how to play Minecraft. Had defeated the blight. Thank you, Aruka. But Lothering was destroyed. Kirkwall was the champion's home now. <laughs> so she made her name. Pickle Rick Snoot. You know what? That's valid. If you really are. It was a busy year in the city. That's when the Kunari landed. A great storm had caught their ship and left hundreds of warriors stranded in the city, waiting to reach. Yeah, I don't think the Gundam Wing Phantom is that different from Gundam as a whole. It's just That's that Gundam as a whole when the trouble began makes fun the of the Gundam ages. Wing Phantom. The Templars had become very powerful under Knight Commander Meredith. But most importantly, that's when I first met the champion. All right, Barrett time. Oh, what? Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot. I installed a mod where uh, every time you do a time skip, you can change your appearance. So are we sticking with Florence in the machine? Making any changes? I think wing fans hate each other despite having similar flaws. Yeah. Yeah. And and I am, I am part of that. I'm not... I am a seed hater who has never watched seed. I just hate the art. Like, when I see it in motion, I'm like, oh, this looks awful um i have it though i uh i got i got the uh, original dvds with the old dub um i'm gonna watch it at some point i just haven't each flaws and winged flaws on steroids keeping florence we're keeping florence I'm, I'm not gonna i'm not gonna do anything more but yeah blue and i already said we're gonna watch seed at some point and then depending on how much we like or dislike seed we'll watch seed destiny but I don't know when we're going to start that. I think the first one we want to watch is neither of us have watched uh, Double Zeta. So I think we're going to start with that. No. What, what is that haircut? I love it. Tits, human. You know how many people want to hire onto this expedition? But we heard you're going into the deep roads. Surely you'll need all the help you can... No! 
Yeah, see, the mech designs are nice. I do like the mech designs, just not the character designs. The weird early 2000s, like, hot topic look. You know who has great fans? OP me. You're right. I love those fans. They're really nice. I'm Pickle Gray. I'll buy you a drink before we head into the deep roads. Everyone wins. Get in line, human. Half of Kirkwall wants to be my best friend right now. You're looking for a quick way out of the slums, right? You and every other Ferelden in this dump. Find another meal ticket. Soldier through the first 12 episodes. You got it. Was that for Seed or Double Zeta? Who tries to sell us out? This expedition was our last chance. Don't worry, Beth. Can't believe you can be mean to Bethany. Who would be mean to Bethany? It's not a joke. Look at her. She's a puppy dog. The best I can hope is to be locked away for the rest of my life if they don't kill me outright. Lucky Blue is the hottest bat in popular media. As long as we're just refugees, we're no one. <sighs> Maybe Gamlin knows someone who can talk to Bartram for us. I kind of regret making those compilations because now, like, we self-reference talking about, you know, like, the the hottest bat in pop popular media. I swear Paprika Jack has said that at least, like, six times since I made that video. Also, if you ever pay attention to the NPCs, I he's just walking into a wall and then walking away. Like... I'll watch that sometimes. They just kind of... They don't know what they're doing. Let's see. I actually um, forgot where we were in this conversation. Tool in the shed. He's all we've got. Make us save us. We might as well ask. Otherwise... Deed never gets good. Double Zeta. I got it. We'll do. I've heard Double Zeta is kind of similar to GT in that in the beginning it seemed like off and then they got back to hey. what they do best for the second half. There he is. There's my boy. And his and his girlfriend Bianca. Who could take every coin out of your pockets just by smiling at you. But you, you don't have the style to work high down, let alone the merchants guild. You might want to find yourself a new line of work. I like to think he staged this entire thing so he could be friends with Hawk. <gasps> How do you do? Varric Tethras. He just taunts service. you with great ideas and never does anything with them. So just like Wing then. Bartrand. He wouldn't know an opportunity if it hit him square in the jaw. But you would. I would. What my brother doesn't realize is that we need someone like you. He would never admit it either. <laughs> I wish I had Varric's voice. Like if if I had his voice, I would go into professional voice acting easy. Or I don't know, just sound better in general. <laughs> I don't like my voice. I don't know if everybody has that, but, like, you hear yourself in a recording, you're like, oh, that's what I sound like. You're part of Bartram's venture. That's right. <laughs> so she will be a dire wolf. Uh, Paprika Jack looking up the, the wikis to give me some, uh, war drops. imagine I have more than a passing interest in this expedition's success. You're going awfully far out of your way just to hire another guard. We don't need Ooh, your voice is fine. I have to listen to it all the time when I'm editing those videos. I haven't gotten annoyed more than like five times. But he can't do it. Invest in the expedition. Fifty sovereigns and he can't refuse. Not with me there to vouch for you. Why would you stick your neck out for a complete stranger? Complete stranger? I know who you are. You're Florence. Where's the machine? And besides... We'd be your partners. I'm willing to give a little trust if you are. I hope there's more to this. Like how I'm supposed to get that much coin together. You need well, the big to plot here is we barely got into the city and we're currently broke. So we are with our broke uncle living in his little hovel and I'm trying to find money. Uh, his brother can take us on this expedition where we get a bunch of money, but they're not letting me in because they don't know who we are. Varric's being helpful. We work together, you and I. And before you know it, you'll have all the capital you need. What do you say? What's to stop you from taking my investment and running? 
you'll be traveling with the expedition and I'll rather be broke than woke that that's cross, something that Wu Fei would say so yeah Gamlin would say it too and I'll be the last rather be broke than woke that's my uh that's my poor British accent you're asking me to take a lot <laughs> any Brits in the chat can confirm that it's bad <laughs> I don't know that I can give you one look I know the Templars have been asking questions how terrible would it be to get out of the city for a while if this works out, you'll be wealthy enough that the order won't be able to touch you. You need the coin and I need your help. We need each other. I can't make it sound better than that. It's not like I had anything better planned. Perfect. Kirkwell's crawling with work. You set aside some coin from every job and you'll have the money in no time. Especially if you had a mod that makes the coin come She's faster. With the city but who would do that? We should talk privately when you get the chance. In the hanged man, maybe. I'll be there when I'm not with you. Now, let's go see what trouble we can stir up. All right, now we now we got Varric and his and his chest hair. Piss their money away. This really is the best place in Kirkwall. All right, so now we're in Kirkwall. This is the this is the big city that we couldn't get into with all this empty space. Let's see, can I can I start the quest with you yet? Elden Street rat, are you here to waste my time or do you actually have coin to spend? Solon, you are absolutely not. I haven't watched it yet, but like, let me just go into a little rant here. Dragon Age Two, this game that I'm playing, among like the Dragon Age fan base, is almost regard always regarded as the bad one. Uh, out of the three people in general like this the least and a lot of them that like it haven't even like played it so uh i am defending it because it is one of my favorite games ever i treasure it and yes a lot of people would say why we'd play that one that's that's the bad one uh so if you like double zeta that's valid if you like seed that's valid like everyone can play or watch or whatever they want without having to uh default to what everyone else's favorite is like i don't care that this guard doesn't know where he's going that's art i, I like that he has no idea where he's going and keep just turning in <laughs> in 270 degree angles that's that's art this is what i came here for and i'm getting it actually my coin and i were just gt fans right up yeah hey, I'm having a grand day. tour grand tour there are few Ferelden's of means in kirkwall forgive me <laughs> echo, the, echo the dolphin was good why are we making fun of echo the dolphin that game scared the shit out of me when I was a kid. When you get too far out in the water and the shark just like eats you. Are you an armorer? A weaponsmith? My stock is varied. What all my wares have in common, however, is quality. Only the best for my distinguished patrons. See for yourself. Yeah, Michael Martin, it is it is interesting how time has changed things. When Dragon Age 2 came out, everybody agreed like, oh, this this one's bad. Then Inquisition came out and it got game of the year and people were like, wow, it's so big and so it's so massive. It's so great. Now, like, you know, 10 years later, because Inquisition is almost 10 years old now, uh, people are like, oh, actually, Inquisition was way too bloated and had nothing going on. Dragon Age 2 actually has a lot of charm. So it's it's weird how time like changes opinions. Here I thought it took blood magic to read minds. I had a twin brother. Carver. Oh, you're always bringing him up. He used to nail my braid to the bed while I was sleeping. I never thought I'd miss him this much. Sorry about your brother. Hey, you want mine? I got a spare. That's cute. Oh, hey, Worthy. What are you doing? Hawk, long time no see, my friend. Well, if it isn't Worthy... The dwarf with the I love I love that they have to like pan to me as I'm shaking his hand because they don't have an animation for two people shaking hands at the same time. Still trying to ferret. Wait, find sand find sandal. Okay, I know where sandal is. I'll go get sandal. Of course. How else do you expect a dwarf to make? I love that Blue is here give, uh, giving like specific shoutouts to the game because he's played it before. You need some rune crafting done. Helps me remember what I need to go find. Take care, Hawk. Don't get dead. Yeah, Echo, Echo, going back to Echo, it was way too hard for, like, 12-year-old me or whenever I played it. Uh, it. It's a game that doesn't hold your hand at all, and you just kind of swim around until you die. Um, I did not beat it until I was in college, actually, whenever I, like, replayed it. All right, Blue, here's here's Sandal. Bodan and Sandal, here we go. Bodan, Fedic, purveyor of goods, both common and rare, at your service. 
And this is my son, Sandal, who is as brilliant an enchanter as your Now father. there's a puppy Say dog. hello to the nice human, Sandal. Hello. We shall be accompanying puppy your dog. expedition and provide... Total puppy dog. More of a puppy dog than Brutus. Quite exciting, isn't it? The thought of adventure does make me giddy. <laughs> a kindred soul, surely. <laughs> Hi, <laughs> Sandal. Do you wish to peruse my wares, or perhaps make use of Sandal's unique talents? Enchantment? Just so. I thought all enchanters were mages. Not at all. The fabled dwarven. It was Dark Souls before Dark Souls. I'm getting the vibe that we should stream Echo sometime. Blue, if you ever want to stream Echo, get, get it out of my uh, many, many years, my Dreamcast box. Why, my boy is a natural, a savant beyond compare. <laughs> I like enchantment. <laughs> and I like you, you Sandal. What more could one ask? Let's see what you have. As much as I want to let him enchant something, I don't have anything to enchant yet. you wish. Kairu, thanks for stopping by for our, for our April Fool stream. I don't know if I'll be doing this again or not, but I am having fun, so you never know. What do you need, my good friend? Oh, whoops. I don't need anything. Not what I meant. I... Go away. All right, I gotta sell my shit. Let's see. Uh, I thought that said bitch core. <laughs> I really thought that that said bitch core for a second. Birch core, got it. Uh, let's see. Oh, I thought I had more than this. What do you got? Yeah, let's just let's just sell this. It's fine. How do I not have anything? I thought that he had a backpack. Oh well. Maybe I installed a mod that changed that. I don't remember. All right, uh, let's move forward with the story. Oh, and give Varric his stuff. Let's see. Abilities. Uh, ba -ba -ba. There we go. All right, let's see. Where do we want to go? Where do we want to go? Uh, we could go to the whorehouse. If anybody wants to... Going into the rose. I don't have any reason to go there yet. We'll go there yet. Later. Stop playing like Fufei. You got it. Uh, okay, I guess I gotta go to... Let's go to Lowtown. Snuggling for a job. Not great, you started the game, now you have to play it all the way through. Oh god, this is... I don't know, this is like a, a 40 to 60 hour RPG, but if you guys want to want me to do it, I'll do it. This load town, it's like made of cardboard or cheese, I'm not entirely sure. It's always looked kind of ugly. Do you ever wish you lived in Orzammar? Great ancestors, no. You know what Orzammar is? It's crab tunnels filled with nug shit and body odor. And every person there thinks he's better in than one you. sitting. Great, great, no, great I mean I could. Or I actually uh, sped through the game to get uh, the final achievement, and I skipped every cutscene and just did the fastest possible route. I can do it in a day. Do a uh, quote speed run. Yeah, I think you've got. Don't you have Varric's thing? There it is. Give me that. Okay, and then let's do this later. Better prices. All right, let's see. Welcome to the other side of the zoo enclosure, Blue. <laughs> yeah. No, I think I think it wouldn't be as. Uh, fun for everybody if you were just constantly supportive and nice and there was like no friction Gather round, all. I bring you a priceless treasure from the highest oh I'm gonna gather around I'm gonna gather around a pouch of Andraste's ashes verified by the oh Andraste is like this game's Jesus just so we're all and provides 
on the same page. Do I have a volunteer? <laughs> we will always be nice to Gray. Thank you, Haruka. Just a small pinch, I bruise easily. <laughs> there you go. Oh, my God. It's gone. Cured by the maker himself. That's enough. Clear out, you charlatans. Wow. They they cleared out super easy. Coin those swindlers nab goes straight to the Carter's coffers. They must be stopped. All right, side quest got it, and then he vanished into the nothing. Let's see, can I get Isabella yet? I don't think I can. All right, so this is the tavern. Every fantasy has to have a tavern. It has some killer music. I don't know what we're voting for, but I also vote for Hobbs. Even Argon's nice to you. Argon has always been nice to me. I don't think Argon has ever said like one bad thing about me. It's just you. Have it's you ever considered, Blue, that maybe he just doesn't like you? Not even a little. Sunshine, I'm a dwarf. In case you missed that detail. Dwarves aren't completely immune to magic, you know. No. <laughs> I could still light you on fire. Meant there are at least 30 people in this town who'd murder my family over trade deals. Who has time to worry the stream about cannot end until we get this bell. You got it. Breathing down your neck. In that case, I see. All right, let's see. Let's get. Oh, I can't get Aveline yet. Got it. I think, if I remember right, if I come back at night, how do I? It's PC. How do I switch to night? Does it not let me yet? There we go. Also, I love all of these loading screens. I know loading screens aren't important, but they've always been kind of mesmerizing, and I always like them. Um, the streets aren't safe at night. I actually didn't. We should do something. I about didn't that. install this on my uh, super fast uh, drive because I wanted to see the cutscenes, or not cutscenes, uh, loading screens. Archon, it's just a tsundere for Blue. Yeah. Ah, uh, Isabel isn't here. I'm sorry, Blue. I think we have to get to a certain part of the story. All right, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta fast forward through the story if we're gonna get Isabella. We got like an hour. Uh, bu -bu -bu. where do I want to go? Where do I want to go? Let's go to get Aveline. Would you pl guys play Damon X Machina? Um, actually, no. I own Damon X Machina. Uh, I got it in one of those uh, buy two get one free sales uh, for Switch. Um, so I have it, but I haven't actually played it yet. Some definition of the term. Do you ever wonder what your life would have been like? I love that because I haven't gotten anyone else, they're just becoming best friends. Just an expensive lifestyle. I've already got one of those. Nobles have power too, and responsibilities. Estates, servants, and I do walk faster. You're right. Assassins. We've still got all those things. It's sunnier here, and nobody calls me my lord. I think I can live with that. All right, let's see. I want to go get Nothing to see here. Aveline, and I think Aveline is up here. It's a good thing I walk faster. Think about how long this walk would be if I didn't. Hello, hello. Don't mind me, just walking through with a giant sword. Nothing fun ever happens here. Or PC. Oh, Damon, uh, Damon X Machina came out on PC? I didn't know that. I thought it was a Switch exclusive. Or at least it used to be. I don't know. Okay, Abilene should be this way. Good luck getting in. I've been waiting all day. Let's see. Uh, I don't think I can do nope. that. Abilene. Hey, best friend. Gray, 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 Gray. I got two copies. I can help you with stuff. I had online missions. Switch my friend. Oh! You don't have to do that, but thank you. Why do you have two copies? <laughs> That's it. What? Oh, right. Sorry. It feels like we just talked. Which has code gas? DLC? I didn't know that. Information is one of the That's few good music. I hope it has job. some of the music. Watch out for Bartrand. He's a son of a bitch. You know I don't like it when you have people watch me. Saved me camping Florence. on your doorstep. Aw, Sato. Well, yeah, we'll we'll here. find we'll figure something out. Well, you're no child. 
Don't be lonely. You're here with us. We're all friends here. The places they have me patrolling, I've got time. A person in your position seems like they might learn some profitable things. You know better than to ask that. One day you'll Don't be frustrated. Don't see. That's interesting. It. It's like I'm. I guess the Switch house. fan base just isn't into giant robots. In city. In fact, I wonder how I Thirteen Sentinels talk. sold on Switch. Let me know if you want to do a favor for Kirkwall. Otherwise, I'm here if you need me. Maker knows I could use more satisfying work. You and me both. All right, Aveline. You have something worth doing? My patrols may be empty walks in the dark, but there's something big coming up, and I could use it. Well, there was a Dark Souls version on Switch, wasn't there? I think Blue got it, actually, if I'm right, but he said it played awful, so he just kind of stopped and then played it on PC instead. Someone to rob. I'm putting a stop to it, my district or not. Seems like you'd want to share this with your fellow guards. I will, if you sit on your hands. I'll send my alerts, and someone else will lead a patrol. But there's profit and but influence. What, but to wasn't it bad? You're my friend. Like, didn't you play so it on Switch friend. and then give up? I seem to remember that, or maybe I'm thinking of a different game. But you like gave up and played. You played it on a different version. All right, Evelyn. I'll play guard for you. I knew I could count on you. They're hidden up Sundermount, remote and rough. But we can make good time with a shortcut this side. Also, I love how our whole no, idea was to make this April Fools. And me. then, like, you, at the very beginning of the stream, I said, there. April Fools! And then it just you became, like, a normal stream. Like, we haven't done anything else. A part of me wanted to do, like, a goofy game that I didn't know how to play and would, like, struggle with. But then I thought, first time streaming, if I don't actually know what I'm doing on screen, Lord, it'll be real hard to, like, I talk to with you guys. Anyway. This is harder than it looks. Let's see. Ah, here we go. I knew there were. Ah, yes, Farrick. Now I have a rogue. Rogue with his wonderful chess hair. All right, we're playing as Varric now. Our whole perspective of the world is just a tiny bit shorter. Let's see. Can I get this quest yet? Looks like no. The office of the yeah, I can't. Okay, got it. The public, especially recent arrivals, not actually part. Do do do. Blue, I'm trying to get Isabella. Hobbs has to go. Oh, we'll see you next time, Hobbs. Mar just to let everyone know, too, uh, Blue had said that he was streaming five days this week. I believe that is the plan. He is streaming tomorrow, not me. This was a one-day thing. So uh, I believe Pokemon Coliseum was what you all voted for. He will be playing that. That that part wasn't a joke. It just won't be today. Today, he's my backup in case anything catastrophic happens while I'm streaming. Am I the next stop in your career evaluations? Joy of joys. You watch and you talk. Is that it? You are dismissing home. Oh god, is she against streaming? And the incredibly dangerous. I don't know what you mean. I think she just called you out let's plays. Flow when I talk and when I shut up. Like if you got paid to guard or unguard. That makes no sense. Good. <laughs> I love Eric. All right, get in the room so I can talk to you. So, here's the thing. We need to find a way into the deep roads. Bartrand can lead us to the right place once we're down there, but we need a good entrance. Any entrance would do, wouldn't it? Well, unless a dragon's sitting in it, I suppose. We need an entrance that's close to our destination, but isn't already plundered or filled with darkspawn. Thank you, Sato. Fortunately, I've received some new information. There's a Grey Warden in the city. If anyone knows how to get down there, it'll be him. Despite being called unhappy, say you seem pretty jolly. Yeah, well, I, this game, this game makes me happy. Uh, I know it's a lot, like, to take in whenever you don't know anything about Dragon Age and all that, and it's probably not the best game to stream first time, but, like, this came at a point in my life where I really needed it, and, uh, it's been there for me ever since. So, I don't know, I've probably beaten this game a total of, I don't know, 12, 13 times, and three of them were in Japanese. That's a whole different story. Um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. This game makes me happy. Maybe maybe if we continue and I keep the name Unhappy Stay, I will play only games that make me 
like furious like i could play yik uh uh I, y2k the y i i k i've been told explicitly not to ever try to play that but if i do i may as well stream it are there any other options uh, none at the moment Bartrand had an you talk about va2 like i talk about sonic yeah it, it it came at a time that i needed it that's all it, it came at a time when uh uh i needed an escape and this was the escape that i needed it it helped me get through some some time so like i will defend this game to my dying breath no one no one can say something bad about dragon age 2 without me like coming in and swinging at him and that Maser is why I Oh god, Paprika Jack is into the idea of Yik. I don't want to. With some other Ferelden refugees not long ago. A low town woman named Lorene has been helping the Ferelden's. We talk to her. Maybe we learn where he is. I mean, Marvel Capcom 3 would be a fun game to do. Uh Paprika Jack could actually come over. We could have like a, a round a round robin kind of thing. I'm a uh I'm a uh a Spencer main, Spencer and Chris were uh, two of my main ones, and then I would switch between, like, Wesker and X-23, and uh, sometimes I tried to pretend that I could play Jill because I wanted to so bad, but I, I never really liked her. All right, now... I gotta find Anders, and then I think I can get Isabella after I have Anders. Don't threaten me with Marvel. I miss Marvel. Uh, Blue, if we streamed a Marvel game... Would you want to do Marvel's Capcom 2, 3, or Infinite? If you had to pick one. Uh, what's the point? You show admirable Shut restraint, up, Bethany. For a mage, you mean? I could also say for a hawk. But yes, for a mage. You have a sword. Why aren't you killing someone right now? Fair point. But I can put my sword down. Believe me, I have tried. Aww. Let's see. Uh, shoot, where is the spot where I learn about Anders? Anders, Anders, Anders. Really does look like a whole bunch of like wet cardboard. Is how they built these buildings. Okay, these are the city slums. There's Gamlin's house. Let's stop by our uh, little hovel, our little hole in the wall. Yeah, but Blue, isn't three fun to watch when we all know what we're doing? I think 2 is more fun to watch when we don't know what we're doing. Because it's an older game. That and I'm biased because I can actually play Jill. Well, Mother was pretty steamed when you ran off with your Ferelden of... Okay, just gonna accept all these. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Okay. I'm still their daughter. I feel like reading is a is a hard thing for streaming. You don't want to see me read a paragraph. Okay, so, uh, actually, can we start? Oh, we could, we could jump to Felicia Day right now, if we wanted, I think. We can jump to Felicia Day or, uh, Corypheus. What's in here? Give me that. Sweet, now I have tons of cool shit. What's in here? Oh, inventory full. Oh, that's a problem. Uh, let's see. Where is my chest? There you are. All right, storage. Attributes. Now. Confirm, okay. Now, where do I? Here we go, okay, I found it. I kind of like relearn how the UI works without my controller. It's hard. Isabella deserves screen time. Okay, yeah, you got it. You got it. I got it. I'm going to get her. Don't worry. Oh, yeah, that's a sword. That, is that even a blade at that point? Like, that's just a metal club. Okay. Um. Then... Blood Dragon Armor... Oh, hell yeah. Or I can look like Dead Space. Here, let, let me put on the Dead Space. Sir Isaac's gauntlet, Sir Isaac's boots. All right. Are we feeling the uh, Dead Space look? Or we can do all Blood Dragon. Then we can, then we can look dope as fuck that way. 
What are we feeling, chat? Dead Space armor. Okay, blue is definitely Dead Space. Ruka, Dead Space. Okay, we're going to go with Dead Space. This was, uh, this came out around the same time. I think they were in the same year as uh, Dead Space 2. So they did some cross promotion because they're both EA. And uh, it's actually a really good armor set for the beginning of the game. So I often use it when I'm doing my playthroughs. Let's see. We'll put on. Uh, improves what? Improves the level up? Sure. 16 attack. I guess this doesn't really matter. I'm on normal. Let's go with uh, that one. And. That one. That one. And. Cool. All right. Now I'm decked out. All right, I look dope. Now what? All oh, the the weapons in the way, but I got I got the little like health bar thing that I has, and then a little uh, Kirkwall logo on the side. Oh, I love this thing. Okay, let's see. What is the fastest way to get to Isabella? I think I need to talk to Bethany. We'll never truly nope. at home as long as we are living with. My children have been in servitude, servitude for a year. They should be nobility. If wishes were poppy, we'd all be dreaming. Dead Space is really fun. I have never played Dead Space 2, though, and I haven't played the Dead Space remake. Um, I've been told that I need to correct that, but I haven't done it. I think it's, uh, I think I have it free on Xbox, if I remember right. I mean, this is real. No wonder I can't wake up. And here I thought that Ferelden you ran off with was a mage, not a jester. Your mother was supposed to marry the Comte de Launce. I have not played Dead Space 3. Uh, Blue told me that he didn't like it. He you said it was kind of like what Resident Evil 5 did that. to Resident Evil, but, like, will. bad. If I could just see for myself. It's not here, all right? It was red. It went in the vault. No one needed to look at it again. Did Grandfather mention Mother in his will at all? Our father died when you were still in Pinafore's girl. Dead Space 3 would be awesome stream? Oh, remember. my bad. Uh, like Blue, if you ever want to stream some Dead Space 3, I think I should play 2 first, but, like... I don't know. That'd be fun. I just need more time off work so we can stream, so we can like do this more regularly. I would love to. That touched a nerve. What's in there that you don't want us to see? Nothing. But you won't be seeing the bloody thing. It's still locked up on the estate, and that's Family, you locked suck. out of my hands. You didn't take your parents' will. It was old news. You think I've been sitting here for 25 years waiting for the So Leandra Blue, if I remember that. right, you Blue have to complete this together. quest before That's you can get you uh, Fenris and well, Isabella, I think. No one you know. So we're, we're going to power through this quest real fast That's to see if we can get to Isabella to before stay. the stream ends. Okay, let's see. I'll go on to storage. Put in some of this stuff I don't need to make some room. The Black Fox is jerking. He's jerking. Uh, put all of you in there. I don't need you. We're gonna we're gonna stay uh, dead space for now anyway. There we go. The funny thing about this game is EA was pushing. Uh, uh, like DLC and day one DLC so hard that if you wait, are they in the exact same animation? Oh, I don't know. I don't know if we should go on this quest. Oh, oh. Okay, that was kind of funny. Uh, but yeah, they give you all all the green ones are like overpowered things you can get at the start of the game. The game is significantly easier if you uh, pre-ordered it. If you didn't and didn't get all that promotional stuff, it's significantly harder. Um, I don't think I've ever actually beaten it on Nightmare without all of the promotional stuff added in. He wasn't like this in Lothering. I think he misses the open fields. Gray, what did I miss? Stepped away <laughs> during your war. Oh, Wu Fei performance. Oh, that was a while ago, man. Um, nothing. We're uh, a year in the future now. Gamlin sucks. We live with him. I have a dog. We're talking about him. Uh, Come on. not much, just getting through Let's the game. Play. Uh, Fetch Blue really wants me to get to a certain character, oh, Isabella, and I'm trying to, like, speed to her as quickly as I can. But if he's with us, who'd keep gambling and debt collectors away? 
take it. I'm sick of your what's his name's name, tearing and panting. Oh, we get to name him. Are we going with are, are we going with the machine? Really easy to remember. Okay. We got three options. We are either going to name him uh Paprika, because Blue wanted that, or Lucky Blue, because Paprika wanted that, or the machine, because we accidentally made Florence and the machine. I vote the machine, but if chat says something else, I can go with that. If we let's see, make sure that it fits. Yeah, the machine fits. We could totally call the dog the machine. I guess Brutus is all. Brutus is also option number four. The machine. Well, your vote doesn't count. You're like next door. You could just like open your door and say the machine real loud. I'm almost out of water. All right, that's the second one for machine. That's good enough for me. We got to get to Isabella. The dog is now the machine. Get up, the machine. Come on, boy. This is no time to play dead. That was not a yawn. That was a pant. All right, let's go get Isabella. You don't have to give me some water. But I would appreciate it since you're right next door. Brutus the Machine, that's what we're calling him. Hey, buddy. Hey, champ. <laughs> that was blue, everybody. All right, let's see. Uh, I think I actually need to talk to her to get the quest. I always wanted to bring you children back to me. There we go. So, I hate thinking badly of family. But did Uncle Gamlin seem a little slippery when he talked about Grandfather's will? Yes. If he but he seems slippery every time he talks, so... Was meant to be mothers, do you think he would tell us? Gamlin can't say good morning without lying twice. That is one of my favorite There's lines. Been such a fit of melancholy since Gamlin told her how angry her parents were. Just said the line you love. Yeah, you came in giggling. She told me... G Gamlin can't say good morning God. without lying twice. It's like coming here ruined every good memory of her child. Blue has actually, like, said that I about... Get some of it back. ...about people we know. <laughs> Unless we somehow turn Gamlin into an upstanding citizen, what's done is done. Gamlin told me he gave the estate as payment to some slaver who beat him at dice. Apparently, Stone, shake our of your head. ancestral home is I've done that. place for slavers from all over Thedas. Gamlin couldn't have just sold himself and saved us all the trouble. <laughs> Can you just imagine him sweeping and scrubbing for some Tevinter matriarch? We're bonding. Though, it is interesting no the way that they made the characters is different. Bethany is like your best friend by default. Like, you have to try really hard to get her to not like you. Because in this the RPG, parents. they have... Uh, system for every character well. where um, their affinity Never towards you will change based on your decisions, what you say to them, all that. But Bethany Starts is like your best friend. Carver, if he lives instead, Starts is just kind of hating you. Like, he's jealous of you. He doesn't like that you get the spotlight. Um, he, he, like, he just starts as kind of a prick, and you have to try really hard to get him to like you. I think that's why I like Bethany more. Oh, she, she's a little cinnamon bun. All right, so let's go get that will. <laughs> Little brothers are just pricks. Yeah. I don't know. When I was young, I I didn't like either of you. We have a sister, too. And uh, growing up, I, there wasn't that much love between us. It's when we all grew I'm up that we kind of like liked each other again. About the circle, Bethany. It's difficult without naming you. Thank you for being discreet. I don't want the Templars at my door. No one does. Let them corral the troublemakers. I just want information. Right. Slick Angus. Slick like Angus. I'm to convince myself I really to gotta be careful with my enunciation said, on that. Yes. Slick Angus. Oh, I gotta sell some shit. Let's see. Let's do this real quick. Uh... Sure, 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 sure. All right. Let's give Bethany her strength. I can't believe I agreed to do this. I'm ruining her 
as a character. Uh, mind blast. We'll give her mind blast. And then Aveline, you'll get uh, Pommel. Okay. And then inventory. Blow through this. Let's see. Where is... Bonus well, lockpicking, there we are. And then... Immunity flanking, sure. This is the boring part, the RPG stuff. Uh, we'll go with... Sure, why not? Cold resistance, that's what he needs. And then you will get health regeneration and willpower and constitution. Cool. You get those, and why not? You get this ring that does almost nothing. Okay, we're good. Now we're good. Let's go get Anders. Wait, what? Blue, you owe to yourself to at least put a question mark behind that, thanks. Oh, I got it, I got it. Your Taker Studios made near 90 bucks? Sweet, man! Was that before or after you gave me $10? Now everyone's gonna judge me. Like when you like are stuck in line in there and then they say, Oh, do you want to donate any money to, you know, this charity that we just whipped up? And then like you feel bad not giving anything, but you also know it's all like through that company, and if you really wanted to donate, you would just donate directly yourself. Oh, uh, let's let's put in a sovereign. There. Now nobody judge me. Back here. That Okay. Now. Uh, you have a backpack? I need those. We'll take that. Okay. If you're seeking aid, leave your name with my girl. Theme up for Disney. We serve everyone here. No oh, which, which Disney are you going to? Disneyland or Disney World? But I can't give priority to anyone who's already found work and lodging. I hear you know where I can find a Ferelden Grey Warden. Some money takes her weapons. Yeah. I've heard of is RPGs are always kind of weird about that. You can just walk in and take what you want. Why would you need a Warden? The healer was one of them once, wasn't he? A Warden? Well, he's not now. And busy enough without answering fool questions about it. The Disney Vault. He's taking a trip to the Vault. Is he, is he gonna see Walt himself? Then I'll only ask very smart questions. I do not joke, Sarah. <laughs> I've always liked that line too. People face in Kirkwall. They have no jobs, no homes. Most <laughs> can barely buy bread. This healer, he serves them without thought for coin. He's closed their wounds, delivered their children. Sure, sure, yeah, go and on. And yet he needs to hide. He's a good man. I won't lose him to the blighted Templars. You mean he's a mage? Would I stick my neck out for some purveyor of hensbane and leeches? We would never turn someone over to the temple. Crazy taxi ever had someone try to take your never. taxi? He doesn't uh, want to I don't think they have that. Just for using the Aren't they making they a new crazy him. taxi? They should make it like reverse Grand Theft Auto, where you have to like try and get away from NPCs who are like trying to kick you out. I can hardly blame him. I suppose it isn't my secret to keep. Anders has certainly been free enough with his services. Refugees in Darktown know to find the healer, look for the lit lantern. If you I love that, enough, by the way. Look for Anders the lit lantern. Does that mean that I none of Darktown lights their lanterns at night? Like, do their lanterns do anything? Look for the lan lantern tells me nothing. 
Uh, Sato calls Caretaker Crazy Taxi. See, you know all of this deep, lucky blue lore. Because I'm always working. I don't get to watch your streams. We heard you in there asking about the healer. We know what happens to mages well, yeah, in this dark town. Down. Fuck you, Blue. That ain't gonna happen to him. Look, we're Vereldans just trying to keep out of the Templar's sight, same as you. Vereldan? But you, your clothes. I figured you for a Kirkwaller, sorry. Make her bless the rule of our King Alistair. Oh good, Alistair's the king in this safe file. That's good. Oh, but we won't get drunken Alistair in the tavern. Aw. Okay, let's see. I don't need to talk to Lady Elegant. In the guard. What will they think of next? I don't care, Eric. Alright, let's go get Anders. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, Blue. I can start taking the fights. I can be Wu Fei in character again. Like, I, I know all the paths to get out of fights. I, I should play more dumb. Instead of, like, knowing what I'm doing. Oh, man, he has places to be. Oh, he wants that rat. No, he doesn't. Oh, my God. This guy looks like he has to shit. Like, real bad. Had a good home once. Lost it all. I am fascinated by this guy. Where are you going? Nope, not those stairs. Okay. You know what? I'm going to leave you in privacy so you can shit. Uh, I need to find Anders, who is this way. Don't like dark tan? Die, Lady Blue. Oh, okay. Hey, do you guys know where the lit lantern is? Because here's a lit lantern. What a crock. Uh, those aren't lit. This one, wait, this one's lit. That one isn't. I was told to look for the lit lantern. Is that? No, it's not there. Okay. So, apparently, either these or this is the lit lantern, but, like... I don't know. It's just, it's dumb. It's dumb. Let's go find Anders. That lantern is so lit. Hell yeah, it is. Hey, Anders. And now he's exhausted. Me after work. Blue after streaming. <laughs> And here comes Florence. I have made this place a sanctum of healing and salvation. Why do you threaten it? Strange occupation for a warden. Aren't you more about taint and death? Not healing and salvation. Wardens are all about the taint. Did the warden send you to bring me back. <laughs> Makes I'm him feel good. good. <laughs> Those bastards made me get rid of my cat. Horse a pounce a lot. He hated the deep roads. You had a cat named <laughs> in the deep roads. I just heard Blue beast. in the other room. Don't say that. A noble beast. <laughs> Almost got ripped in half by a Genlock once. He swatted the bugger on the nose. Drew blood too. The blighted warden said he made me too soft. I had to give him to a friend in Amaranthine. I'm part of an expedition into the Deep Roads. Any information you have could save people's lives. I will die a happy man if I never think about the blighted Deep Roads again. So this guy here was from the first game's DLC. I'm not interested. Uh, Although, so they, they talk a bit about what happened last game, but favor. obviously that's just extra that information that doesn't deal? matter. You, you change me. a lot between games. Help you. Let's be more specific. I don't do anything involving children or animals. <laughs> I have a warden map of the depths in this area, but there's a price. I came to Kirkwall to aid a friend, a mage, a prisoner in the wretched gallows. Yeah, the character design on him is awesome. The the him. dragon head, the like Help me bring him safely past kind of to venter look to everything. It just it it all comes together well. Oh, that's all. I might just take my chances with the darkspawn. If we fight the Templars. It is because they decide that anyone who befriends a mage deserves death without questioning. As just as his cause is, it scares me. Of course it does. You're a little puppy dog. You're not a tire wolf yet. Your strength is only 19. If you want my aid with your expedition, 
Meet me in the Chantry tonight. I have sent word to Carl to be there. Make her willing, we will all leave free men. All right. Now let's go to Bethany's this side quest. Let's go in and see why Gamlin lied. All right. So I think we need to finish Bethany's thing, then finish Anders thing, then we can get Isabella. Can we do that in only like 30 minutes? We're going to see. Hey guys. I'm just going to kill you. No context. Oh, get out here, the machine. Get him, boy. What a mess. I knew this would happen. Oh man, he's a rogue. I wish I were a rogue. Okay, there we go. Now I can see. While, while I'm fighting randomly on normal mode and just killing people, um, when this game came out was right when uh, I was moving across the country. So um, Blue and I were originally in Ohio. Uh, our dad got a new job out in Oregon. And uh, when I found, uh, or when, when I got to my senior year in college, I should say, um, it was kind of time to move on and I moved across the country. The entire premise of this game is being, like, the older sibling trying to take care of your, like, other sibling uh, in a new and unknown area. Um, over time, trying to make, like, new connections in this new place that you found. Uh, sort of a found family setup where you try and decide, like, if this new area is yours. Um, like, your home where you want to be. And the fact that I was playing this game right at the time when I was doing that exact same thing... Um, I think that really helped me kind of get through that era, uh, that time in my life when I was really depressed. So it's a big part of why I always come back to it. I kind of wanted to share that story, but I didn't know when because they talk so much in this game. <laughs> Let's give you some more... Cunning. There we go. And Reign of Arrows. Okay, now... Get this chest. Get... Get... Oh, I'm still paused. Whoops. <laughs> now use your new thing. Go shoot him. There we go. Now someone farted. Getting everywhere. <laughs> Here, Tigger, this is his show. I believe in him. Thanks, buddy. Now, Blue, Blue will be back to his regularly scheduled antics tomorrow. And uh, he is still doing the, the, like, full four days, I believe. I, however, will be at work. That should do it. Everything we want to know about our family is inside. Yeah, that's great, Bethany. I'm just going to go ahead and do it. We got to get to Isabella. I'm sure that your character is arc is My very important. Will. Mother needs to see this as soon as possible. Tip for Catra to play. Let Let me be honest, caretaker. Catra is a very difficult voice for me to do. Um, whenever I went to those recording sessions, I would actually talk in my higher register for like a full hour before we even got to then. We'll take it to her um, right now. Because like, I don't naturally talk like that. It's very difficult to uh, have a range. So I can't really get into it immediately. Like I can try, so you know, do a couple say, like Troa, Troa, and like try and do that, but like it's hard. I have to only talk like, like that for a while. To be able to act. It's only fair if you make I don't even know if I could do a full stream. I think my voice would give out before we got to the end of it. You sold my children into servitude. Now you're asking me to pay rent. Uh, maybe just stand up with your mother. Towards food. You should be paying us, Uncle. We found the will. He forgave you, Mother. Grandfather left you everything. Here, read it. 
Uh, ah, I should maybe. To my daughter. God, he Leander, sucks so much. All children born of her. The estate in High Town and all associated revenues. Check out the part where Gamlin is left only a stipend to be controlled by you. Yeah, she is about to kill him. You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more. Can't spell gambling without gambling. Yeah, I'm sure that was intentional. You didn't even come home for the funeral. The twins were a week old. We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, I love that he's trying to justify, like, losing everything that was supposed Sister, to be hers. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't die angry. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. Make a willing. You'll have your house. Back, <laughs> That's not entirely on him. You yeah. That's what gambling addicts do, though. He lost all of his apes. You've got to be he someone he bought too many, uh, too many orbs and Fire Emblem heroes. All right, that's one quest down. We 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 made Gamlin suck it. Good boy. Who's a good the machine? Keep it down, dog. All that noisy dog breath, day in day out, make him stop. Well, pardon my dog for breathing. <laughs> if you think you can stop him, be my guest. Did you see that we made fun of Blue behind his back during the ad break last week? No, I didn't. I was at work. I I didn't see a single one of his streams while I was working. Hey, Aruka, welcome back. You you missed us uh, shitting on Gamlin. Uh, he actually stole like all of our mom's money, and uh, he's mad that my dog is breathing. So that's why Gamlin sucks. In this SI, I will. When I hey, told mom. Your grandmother what do you want to say? She threatened to disown me. She said my children would be mongrels. My father wanted to lock me in, but she told him it's her life. Let her ruin it. I wrote to her when each of you were born. She never wrote back. I'm glad she didn't die hating me. Is it just me, or aside from the gray hair, does she not actually look that old? The estate is yours. Why are we still here? Technically, the house is now property of the Viscount, since its owner died without an heir. If we went there now, we would just be squatters. But if the Viscount acknowledges our rights, we can get back more than the house. We can get back our name. Oh, I, I feel bad for picking this one. Your mother's dead. Let it go. That doesn't well, seem very dead. sarcastic. Your grandmother was the young... He's lead, pushing 27. ...noble mother all my friends wished they had. Like, if she my hair were greying and I had birth. that few of wrinkles, I would be very happy with my jeans. Carver. He was such a little boy. Never had a knee that wasn't scraped or trousers without holes. No, he... He was just uncoordinated as fuck. Carver sucked. The last thing Carver would want is more crying. I just keep thinking there's something we could have done. It's killing me. I... I, I mean, technically, biologically, yes, she could be a grandma at 27, but uh, dear God, I hope that no one is a grandma at 27. This is not the Dark Ages. At least you're past the it's all your fault thing. I'm sorry, love, I was distraught. I never really believed that. It's just, I miss him. There were four of us when the blight began. It will never be over while there are just three. I've written to the Viscount. It is Darktown, yes. We are stuck in Darktown. The one the place with the Couldn't one lit lantern. Cover. You know to look for it. I could at least give us a home. Alright, that one's all done. Now let's go see if Isabella shows up. I think we have to do Anders too, but we will try. So we go to nighttime. Hangman. Yeah, Paprika Jack's uh, Twitch streams are fun. I was able to watch some of those uh, all my days off. Oh, stupid chair, get out of my way. Okay. Damn it, she's still not here. 
Okay, so let's go to here. This should be where we do Andrew's quest. These streets should be safe at night. Care to help out with that? Sure. Let's just go beat up some pe Are these just... What are these? Did my mods do that? I'm pretty sure my mods messed up a texture. This doesn't... Is this just like papers frozen in place? <laughs> Oops. I'll look into that later. Okay. Now... The machine! Get him, boy! God damn it, I hate when I miss and then I just, like, stand there not doing anything. The controller's so much easier, you just press A in their general direction. Guys, why are you even out here? We just want to go to the Chantry so we can help Anders. Bethany, you got strength. Let's do this. Oh, never mind. It's already over. No, it's not. There is a red dot on my map. We're, we're coming to get you, buddy. We're coming to get you. Don't think we forgot about you. What? Why can I not? There. Okay, hold on. Why are you not? Just hit him. There we go. Look, look at her health bar. Look at how small it is. That's because Jack paid me $5 to put everything into strength. Kill your sister. Oh god, oh god. Uh, Bethany, can you do another heal? Oh, that's not good. Okay. Let's see. Okay, I think he's fine. There we go. Alright. We did it. Side quest finished. People dead. What do you call it when you kill everyone and take all their stuff? Your initiative was the attack you. My bad. The, I, I really need to emphasize, on PC, this is an entirely different user interface. On controller, like, this all down here isn't here. Uh, there's a separate pause screen that pulls up a, a like, radial thing that then you select with uh uh you know your controller or joystick to figure out like what you're going to do next um doing this it's like i'm relearning how the game is played oh my gosh just take oh, that was weird there we go where is the goddamn chantry it's over here come the machine we need to go to church. I saw Carl go inside a few minutes ago. Carl. No Templars. So Carl. Far. Are you ready? I didn't see anyone suspicious out here. Let's do this. <laughs> Besides all the people right. I killed, they're I'll not suspicious anymore. You watch for Templars. All right, so in this universe, the Chantry is their church, Andraste is their Jesus, the Maker is their God. It's all kind of parallels with that. 
Um, but they also suppress mages, which is a big part of this. That's why he doesn't like this place. All right, so here's uh, the totally not occult church. Uh, I need to go upstairs. Uh, and I think this is actually the only instance in the game where we come in here at night. I might be wrong on that. Carl, where are you? There you are. Hey, Carl. What's up? Anders, I know you too well. I knew you would never give up. What's wrong? Why are you talking like... I was too rebellious. Bum, bum. Like the Templars knew I had to be made an example of. No. How else will mages ever master themselves? You'll understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars teach you to control yourself. This is the apostate. All right, Hulk out. No! Hulk out. Here you go. Become cool. There you, you go. Never take another mage as you took him. All right, yeah, so he's got like a spirit of justice in him and he just hulks out sometimes. Anders is cool. And very trust trustworthy. He would never do anything to like harm me or my friends. That's why they call him trustworthy Anders. You know, one thing I actually do miss from uh, uh, Dragon Age Origins, because I played it recently, they have these uh, uh, kill attacks. You essentially have, like, a, a random chance of ending a fight sooner with a, like, uh, final kill, and it has a unique animation. They took that out for this game, and I kind of miss it now that I'm playing it again. When we find... I... Anders, what did you do? It's like... Wait, the giant RX-78 is being taken part. down? I had already forgotten Why? what it feels like. I didn't know that. Why are they taking it down? I never got to see it. What did you do? Not the fade part. The angry glowing bit. It's like a gateway to the fade. Anders is cool. Is that why you've never romanced him? I have never romanced him because of how cool he is, yes. Because he's very trustworthy and lovable. How did they get you? The Templars here are far more vigilant than in Ferelden. They found Man, that sucks. I didn't know that. I imagine it, Anders. All the color, all the music in the world, gone. I would gladly give up my magic. But this, I'll never be whole again. This is what mother was protecting. I can't believe they're canceling Grandpa Please, Gundam. Kill me before I forget again. What did he ever do wrong? I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. Maybe we can find a cure. Can you cure a beheading? The dreams of tranquil mages are severed. So yeah, there's there a lot here. He fix. has been made tranquil, which I means essentially his soul is gone. And live as a Templar he temporarily has it back to make him feel bad. That's that's like all that this quest is. So we're just gonna let him kill him. Do it, Anders. I'm sure you won't kill other people later in the game. Give him peace. I got here too late. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. Now it's fading. Why do you look at me like that? Yeah, get it out of your system. Rip off that band-aid. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm sure I'll do the same to you later. We should leave before more Templars come. All right. Now I think we can get Isabella. I'm pretty sure. If not, then we just sped so, through those two for no reason. <laughs> this is the part where you tell me you're an abomination? You're wrong. But not far wrong. I... This is hard to explain. When I was in Amaranthi, yeah, we just spirit of justice, we just murdered was tons of fate. people and then walked out. No consequences. The That's kind of a theme of the game. The, this game, so to give some context, Dragon Age Origins, the one that came before that, technically had a ten-year development cycle. The actual game development was much shorter than that. But with the story, the lore, uh, what they were setting up, they had essentially ten years to try and create their perfect game. This game was made in 16 months, which is shorter than, like, a Call of Duty of that time. 
uh there are a lot of cut corners to try and get what they wanted in here so it's essentially like like speeding through to get to the highlights um why i love it is i fell in love with every single one of these characters uh i love this game to death but it also has a lot of cut corners like the fact that they throw so many enemies at you to try and like pad the game out and make it last longer uh so you will just like slaughter 50 people then walk out and get all high and mighty on someone because they're going to kill one person. Um, there's kind of a disconnect and there, and it's kind of funny. Than a demon. Just as demons prey on the deadly sins of mankind, there are good spirits who embody our virtues. Spirits of compassion, fortitude, justice. They are the maker's first children. Also funny, anytime you're in Dark Town, they house. apply this, like, echo, but we're standing right next to each other, so it's kind of weird that I just hear an echo the entire time. What does this have to do with your eyes glowing? To live outside the Fade, he needed a host. I offered to help him. We were going to work together, bring justice to every child ever ripped away from his mother to be sent to the Circle. But I guess I had too much anger. Once he was inside me, he changed. <laughs> That's why you never let them inside on the first date, man. So... You have this spirit of justice living in your head. It's not like that. He's gone now. He's part of me. Andrews, it's you're making like no sense, buddy. Have a conversation. Yeah, he's, he's got he's got own. the spirit of justice not inside him and can hulk out randomly. That's his whole thing. And he begins. <laughs> Don't say that. Blue, you have the entire Mario Kart video where you guys talk about eating shit. I will say what I want. That really didn't look like a happy benevolent spirit from where i was standing since when is justice happy justice is righteous justice is hard blue feeling blue you tried to help a friend dabu dee dabu die no harm can come of that i wish i still had your innocence gray is it templar a synonym for massive me. asshole um kinda that. the but my anger, the hard thing about the game's duality is they try to present me, a like both sides have out equal points comes out. uh sort of thing going on with the entire he game no longer my so justice. templars are suppressing mages mages want to be no free naturally you want to root for the mages the mages also when they have that freedom cause some destruction because of like some bad apples that are ruining the entire bunch um but by the end of the game if you actually agree with the templars after everything that's been shown you feel kind of evil like it's not like a a thing where both sides have a legitimate point it's 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 much more one sided than that. It's difficult for me to do the uh, the route where you side with the Templars. Also, I can randomly flirt with people. Should we flirt with Anders? We, If I do continue this game, you guys are going to decide who I end up romancing. So do we flirt with Anders, yes or no? Does he, does he seem like the kind of guy we want to get with? So blue is turning dark blue. Yeah. Uruka says, nah. It's a three-way... <laughs> <laughs> Bob Bill says no. Okay, we're we're not feeling Anders. Anders doesn't get flirted with. Wow, your problems make mine seem small. Yeah. The funny thing is, in These the first the game that he shows area. up, he's a constant flirt. He's like a very person. flirty guy. Then in this game, he's defense. like the point of contact for the entire Mage Rebellion, so they have to make him kind of grumpy and sad the whole time. He kind of lost his flirty side. If you play Dragon Age Origins Awakening. He's, he's like a completely different character. Okay, so I only need... Abilene, I don't need you. I am the warrior this party needs. I will swing the sword. Okay, Anders, we are just friends. See ya. All right, now let's see if we can get Isabella. Because if not, we're running out of time. <laughs> One thing is, uh, I cannot stream later than three. Oh, he's going. You you still need to shit, buddy? Okay. Uh, we cannot run late today because we have to pick up uh, our dear sweet mother from the airport. So uh, can't can't stay late. Once it hits once it hits three hours, I gotta go. But let's see if we can get Is Isabella. Isabella's wonderful. Oh, here we go. Blue, we got Isabella. All for you. We made it. You owe us, Isabella. Well, Lucky, I'll tell you what. Since the information you gave me was worth nothing, that's what I'll pay you. 
Me and my boys will get our money's worth, bitch. Oh. Poor sweet. Shouldn't have said that. Is this worth dying for? Isn't she great? <laughs> I didn't think so. There you go, Blue. We got Isabella. We made it. Okay, can you turn my, my sister into a lesbian? Hey, what's up? You're new around here, aren't you? Welcome, and keep your wits about you. You're nothing but tits and arse to the men in this place, and they won't hesitate to grab at both. Speaking from experience, are we? <laughs> Bang. Few broken I vote we won't answer. There, okay, that's that's idea. one vote for Isabella. I'm Isabella. She is by. Previously Captain Isabella. Sadly, without my ship, the title rings a bit hollow. You're Ferelden, aren't you? You have that look about you. I was in Denerim not too long ago. You I know, looked completely different then. Just what I'm looking for to solve a little problem I have. <laughs> Not just would will. Yeah, if if chat votes for Isabella, uh, I will absolutely romance Isabella. Can't anyone fix their own lives around here? Must be something in the water. Someone from my past has been pestering me. I've arranged for a duel. If I win, he leaves me alone. But I don't trust him to play fair. <laughs> I need someone to watch. But no, back. for real, that cutscene made it look like smashes his face into her chest. Yeah, I've always thought that when I see it. Um, and and let me tell you, when I was on, because uh, I got all the mods for this game from Nexus Mods to make it look a little nicer, add some stuff. Uh, there are far too many Isabella-specific mods. I didn't install any of them. There are a lot. <laughs> all right, so let's see. Let's 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 learn Who's some bit a bit about Isabel. We're not speeding through His now. His name is Hader. We worked together back in Antiva. He's never liked me. He's been asking about me all around Kirkwall. Correct. It's just two cannonballs. Him, meet him face to face. I mean, there are mods to give her bigger boobs. They they're already rather large. Let's see. You wanted information from Lucky. What was it? I asked Lucky and his boys to track down something I lost. They failed to do it. None of us knew this game, so it's you could have. Yeah, about. it's true. Much more just like, yeah, no, that's that's the normal size. Just like like two watermelons stuffed in a shirt. Why a duel? <laughs> I like jewels. It's what I do. And if I win, he'll be dead. Problem solved. The interesting thing is, her whole character ended up in this game. Uh, like, she wasn't necessarily designed for this game. She ended up in the first one as a brief side quest so you could learn dueling uh, as, like, a, a skill type. And then as they were rushing to get this game together, they thought, you know, let's make a pirate. Then they thought, oh, wait, Isabella, let's pick her. But she was just some random NPC before and looked like no one. They had to give her an entirely new design. But they wanted, like, a dueling one that could teach you dueling in this as well. So when she says, I like dueling, that's just a callback to that. What makes you think I'm right for this? You saw me talking to Lucky, didn't you? Those boys couldn't manage simple information gathering. I can't trust the riffraff in this place to do anything right. But you, you're different. All right. I think I could manage watching your back. <laughs> I'll bet. I've arranged to yeah, we'll bang, to okay. after dark. I'll meet you there. All right, I think we've got enough time to do Isabella's quest. We'll do Isabel's quest and then we'll call it a day. How's that sound? Well, we got we got like twenty minutes. We might be able to fit something else. All right, let's. Oh, I can't add her to party yet. Okay. You know what? Bye, Anders. We're getting Aveline. You want if you want Caddy, you need Aveline and Isabella together at the same time. Um, do I go to High Town? I think. Or is it the docks? Yeah. We can have a full girl party. 
I think that's... Oh, no, we're missing uh, one girl, uh, Meryl. Meryl is, is... You know, I keep saying Bethany's a puppy dog. Meryl is like a new porn puppy dog who also has a killer instinct. Uh, she's, she's my favorite, but we haven't gotten to her yet. There you are. I've been here for hours. Hader hasn't shown up. Ow, we, no we just has. left. I don't like this. Girls night. I don't like this. <laughs> That's right up there with what could possibly go wrong. That's the witch we're looking for. Got her. Hey, what about me? Oh, wait, the machine. I forgot to call you. The machine. I need you, buddy. Fighter. Fighter toes. Hader sent hiding in the chantry and sending thugs to finish me off. Coward. He'll right? get away with this. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, hold on, hold on. I gotta catch up. Oh my god, you run so fast. Isabel, I didn't know you were, you were a world-class sprinter. There we go. <laughs> She's off. Yeah, Brutus the Machine I don't think would have fit. I think that's too many letters, so we're just going with the machine. I'll call him Brutus for short. If I say it too loud, though, then I'll accidentally call our real dog, and it'll come to my feet wondering why I summoned him. Can you, like, heal? Oops. That's what I meant. There we go. Everybody's just off doing their own thing. The thing is, at higher difficulties, this is something that I'm actually supposed to, like, you know, pause and move around to, like, issue orders and have people flanking and all that. On normal, you can kind of just push buttons and it'll eventually go your way if it's not a boss. All right. Uh, Isabel, do I talk to you? Isabel, where did you... Where are you? Ah, there you are. She really hightails it. Meryl's a nice redhead and my favorite Metal Gear girl. Yeah, uh, this Meryl is um, an elf, and she is like the most sheltered uh, party Isabel, character I can think of. She's she's wonderful. Here. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. You should have let him know you survived. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do without. Lost it? Just like you lost <laughs> oh, the man. Back to the chantry where you murdered a bunch of people tonight. Cargo, yep. They were people. We are in a Those church twice in the same night, killing at least 20 people each time, some of whom waters. work for the church. And now the relic's gone too. Castillo won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. Will someone explain what's going on? Isabella's been a very I have never done it this fast. It's so funny that you go back to the church twice in one night to kill a bunch of dudes. She didn't tell you. I told her enough. I said I arranged for a duel, which I did. I also said you wouldn't play fair, which you didn't. We can talk later if you want. Right now we have other problems. Cassion isn't a very happy person, is he? Maybe he needs a new hobby. There's only one way to settle this. Yeah, get him. Super slow-mo. You missed. It, it was him you were aiming for. Oh my god, just hit him. There we go. Got it. The machine! Come and help me! Fight his nuts! Oh, 
Man, Warrior really is just kind of standing here and swinging, isn't it? See, how do I... Ah, there you are. I found the button. I couldn't see it because of my microphone. I had no idea how I could just get a health potion. Yeah, the game really, like, tries to pad these out so that the game feels longer. And now it's really funny in context because we came back to the church in the same night. God, when I watch this again, I'm going to see, like, how many I actually killed here. I'm so curious. Yep. Stab first, ask questions later. Trust me, it's better this way. That almost sounded like an innuendo. Hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. <laughs> Green, yes, this is a the dead space uh, armor so that, that uh, they made for the game because they released at the same time. This is Sir Isaac's armor. What's so interesting about the relic? I don't really know what it is, except that it's ancient and worth my weight in gold. You the killed more than what is legally allowed. I think that's one. Slaves. I don't know. I but don't think this city allows like, ah, oh, it's just the death. one. Everybody gets now one. You're fine. Easy. You hired Lucky to track down information on the relic. That's right. He insisted he knew everything that was going on. This time on Top Gear. He lied. <laughs> I bet he doesn't even know everything going on in his pants. <laughs> Blue, I think he means when uh, when you typed in all caps, you said you can't say that or don't say that. I forget what I said. It was it was something bad. Did you end up in Kirkwall because your ship was destroyed? There was a storm. The ship ran aground on the reefs near the city. I managed to make it to shore. Most of my men weren't as lucky. <laughs> It was funny that, uh, just in case someone joined late, Blue is actually in the room right behind me, in case I have issues, because I typically don't uh, do streaming. So at one point, he shouted out, Don't say that! Like, through the wall. Like, it's my stream, I'll do what I want. Who is Castillon? He's a powerful merchant based in Antiva. I believe he has ties to the Felicissima Armada. I used to work for him. The jobs mostly involved smuggling lyrium, jewels, or the occasional criminal acquaintance. He paid well. Well, I killed a bunch of people, and I would love to be your acquaintance. What's this about you freeing slaves? I was asked to escort Castillon's cargo ship. I got a bad feeling about the job partway through. Boarded the ship to find slaves. Nearly 200. Elves, humans... More than that is a problem, because the IRS will get unhappy. They paid Castillon to take them away from the Blight. He took their money and sold them into slavery. Even I know that's wrong. I will never Didn't expect that, did you? not love the blood-covered conversations after a fight. Yeah, I think I clicked on all these. And I can't flirt with her yet. If getting the relic gets Castillon off your back, then I'll help you retrieve it. I still don't know where it is, but you'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hader. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. And I have a room at the Hanged Man if you're looking for company later. There it is. We'll bang, okay? All right. I'm sorry, Varric. I'm very sorry. You are wonderful, but it's girls' night now. Girls' night at the church. Among all the all the dead, the corpses left in our wake. We had a very, very eventful girls' night. And then Isabella went to the chantry and saw that it was boring. Canticle of Isabella, stanza one. Okay, what am I giving you? What am I giving you? Let's do that. That. There we go. First one. What do you say? Oh, I can't. 
There we go. How should I know? Do I look like the leader of this merry band of misfits? Good boy. Okay. I don't think there's anything in here I need to get. Eh, it doesn't matter. All right, we got Isabella. And we're hitting 530 on the dot. Not bad, not bad. Oh, wait, Sato says, Gray, 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 you gotta build up the he friendship. Never mind, <laughs> never mind, she thirsty. <laughs> yeah. In getting rid of them. Yeah, she, so, essentially, she is, like, someone who kind of identifies uh, uh, with her sexual nature. It's a very big part of her character. Um, in the first game, uh, when she was still just an NPC, uh, you could actually end up having... I mean, it's all off screen. It's not like it's a sex game, but uh, you could end up having as high as a foursome, depending on who you were dating and who was in your party at the time. And when you meet those characters later in the games, if you had like any sort of relationships with them and Isabella, every time they meet, they'll be like, oh, hey, it's you. Uh, it's it's really funny every time. But uh, yeah, she thirsty. That's that's a big part of her. All right. I think I think uh, that's a good place to end it. We got Isabella like like Blue wanted. Uh, we got, we got the girls' night. If, uh, you enjoyed this, let us know. I may stream in the future. This is, uh, this is a bit out of my wheelhouse. I prefer doing scripted stuff that I can, like, edit the crap out of and make sure I like it before hitting send. Uh, I'm sure that I'll re-watch this at some point and, like, hate the sound of my voice the entire time I'm doing it. But, uh, uh I really do enjoy this game. I enjoy, uh, doing stuff for you guys on YouTube. Um, and I want to do more of it. So if this is something you enjoyed, let us know. Um, if there's something you'd like a stream snips of for some reason, let me know. I can make that. Uh, I'm going to be trying to make more of Blue's things uh, here in the near future. Um, so that you can catch up on older games that he may have played before you started watching us. Um, but yeah, I had a lot of fun. Uh, I hope that you all did too. Thanks for sticking around for our April Fool's. Um, I mean, it's not that much of an April Fool's. It's just like, ha, ah, I'm here, April Fool's. But uh, this is the only time I'm doing it this week. Uh, as far as I know, it's the only time I'm doing it. But if you guys ask for it, we can do it again. Tomorrow, it'll be blue. Uh, I think he is doing Pokemon Coliseum. That's what you guys voted on. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy that. Um, so, yeah. I don't really know how to end this because he says, love you, bye. Uh, that's not really me. So, I guess I'll just say, uh, like you, see ya? Like you see, is that what we're going with? Too late, Gray, you lock in. Okay. Love you. Bye.